Let's get a sip out of our cup of bubbles and water refrigerator and give me my dookin. Gotta get that coffee up in me. How are we all doing? Happy Tuesday, everybody. Happy Tuesday, all you lovelies. Look at this. Three hours ago, somebody named Wolf comes in and just throws down six months worth of subs. I'm not even streaming three hours ago. That is amazing. Wolf, I don't know if you're here hanging out, but thank you so much for that. Goodness. Magnum Indy, the tier one as well. Sleepy Sushi. <laughs> Sleepy Sushi. <laughs> see, what, see what I mean? See how easy it is to make kids laugh with the names? I love them. I love the names. Sleepy Sushi, Sleepy Sushi, seven months. Newly is Prime with the 17 months. And JT Leo, the new Prime sub. How are we all doing? Get a little bit more of this coffee in me. Got after it this morning, man, with work. Woke up really early morning. Impulse and I went, had a, had a, had a, we do that. We try to do that once a week. Meet up for a, a walk on Tuesday mornings. Met up really early this morning. Uh, went and did that and then got after it with work. Cause you know, I wanted to continue my edit on my episode. And I also wanted to stream today. I want to stream because we did such good work yesterday. Right. So what we did. You and I, uh, with the with the foundation of uh, layer one. If you weren't here, I'm going to show you in a second. Uh, but uh, we did good work, and now it's time to start actually creating the path. I already made the time lapse of what we did yesterday, but I think I'm going to include what we're about to do, uh, which reminds me, let's go ahead and stop that recording. Uh, I, I think I'm going to include what we're about to do based on the science we did with Dibbled Up, uh, and uh, and then that will be part of to kind of cap off that time lapse, which you'll see, and hopefully. I shouldn't even say this out loud. Why would I say this? I would like this video to come out tomorrow. That's what I would like. Look at the drummer dev says, how's work slash hermitcraft balance going? <laughs> you know, it's brutal. I'm gonna tell you that right now. It's brutal, but it's a great problem to have. You know, yesterday was like another day. Yesterday was a, was a, was a 12 hour day with a, with a 20 minute lunch break. But I love this. So, you know what I mean? So it's fine with me. Noise warning. Estimated time, seven minutes. What is that? What's that going to do? What am I, what am I supposed to expect out of that? Interesting. Did you guys hear? Oh, that's what it was. Okay. He's, he spawned the wither. Literally that happened just at the same time that the <laughs> came in. <laughs> which is amazing um miss redtail 25 months says nooch thank you miss redtail and then uh akira gator with the 420 hey mr skiz how uh mr skiz the man how are you went to jury duty and came back with a fever aches and brain zappies time to be a blanket burrito and listen to your stream i don't like that you got a fever that sucks oh i think we're gonna get that noise a lot i think he's gonna do lots of withers we'll get some rest and settle on in Look at this guy. Some guy named Impulse. 51 months. Dipple Dop. Thanks, Dipple Dop. Thanks, Impulse, buddy. Uh, Glypto with the 200 biddies. Aces with a new sub. And Fizz with a new sub. How's my daughter doing? She, um, you know, I actually talked to the wife earlier today. And it's been, she's, she's, she's a little bit on the struggle bus right now. Uh, are we not supposed to be sleeping? Is there a reason nobody's sleeping? I know B-dubs is on the server. Let me see if it says no sleepy. Uh, nothing there. And let's see. Ready? And okay. This is okay. I don't see anybody that says don't sleep. I feel like somebody's watching my stream and I'm about to get static as a joke. It's April 2nd, but I'm going to call an April Fool's joke if they do. Um, it was, it's been rough. I think what's, let's do, what in good gracious are they doing? Wow. Oops. Someone wants to pack a fight. Anyways, uh, it's been rough. I think what's happening is this with my daughter. In case this is news to you, my daughter is a, a D1 athlete. Um, softball player and she had a um, she had a season ending injury she uh, tore her ACL all the way through and then during the uh, reconstructive surgery they uh, saw that she actually damaged her meniscus as well so her recovery it only happened six days ago I'm sorry it, the injury happened weeks ago the 
uh, surgery was six days ago. So it's been it's been rough for her. Um, she's like she's one of those people. She's so like strong that she's like any challenge. She's like whatever. Let's go. You want to tear my ACL? That's fine. I'll get the surgery. I'll get it back under control. She she doesn't have a lot of patience. She just is one of those. She works hard, works hard, works hard. This is like it doesn't matter how hard you work to get back. You have that you have to exercise great patience. And she is she's struggling with that bit. So that's hard. That's hard to deal with, and especially from a distance being over here working. So. That's just where we're at. That's where we're at. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. So uh, if you guys weren't here yesterday, we went ahead and we got this first layer, just the lighting set up. What is going on? How many? Jeez. How many are you doing? I'm thinking like uh, however many there are, let me see. Let's see if he answers. Up, uh, 64. Hold on. I'm not smart enough to not do this without a calculator. There we go. That's 192 heads. That's 192 heads. That's crazy, right? That noise is the wither, right? <laughs> That's insane. What in the world is he doing? I never know what she's doing back there. Look at all this more love coming in. Jeez. Min Wheats with the nine months. Dumber with the hundred biddies. Lusting Nemo, four months. Good day to you, the man of skizzle. Of the skizzle. Hope you had an awesome vacation. Also, wish to send some healing vibes to your daughter. Is the going back to work thing working out okay? Where yeah, it's it's been a struggle. It's been a struggle. And I've explained the logic of this before. Um, I, I kind of psychoanalyze, like, why am I so frustrated lately with work? And it's because, because in that job, I mean, time's not money, I guess. That's the best way I can put it. So in that job, they're just trying to get through the day. They're doing great work, but they're just trying to get through the day. Whereas me, I'm like, every time they're doing something that in my mind is a waste, I'm like, no, I'm not doing that. That's a waste of time. And it's not being very well received. Uh, Mill with the four four months, you're amazing. Nest Noodle, two hundred biddies. Mewy, twenty four months. Wasaki, you're not Wasaki, but I'm calling you Wasaki. It says Weski. Uh, sixteen months. Goodness gracious. Ninty, the hundred biddies. Dodger, two months. Oh, I gotta put in my uh, my proper mod chat my mod channel. Skiz, you're a true inspiration here. I want to read this. This is nice. I love when people say great things about me, and I like to read it out loud. I actually do because <laughs> I'm not too proud because you're a true inspiration I was a vi whoa what I was a victim of a shooting not a DNR right I was a victim of a shooting and struggling during the recovery your great outlook on life and positivity helped me remember it's never as bad as it seems okay I'm glad okay I'm glad I want to tell you I'm glad that you're having this great disposition but I refuse to accept the slightest bit of credit for that that is a very traumatic experience that I fortunately can't currently identify with so i'm but i'm glad i'm just get to the other side of that that sounds awful plp says i guess that wren was waiting for you to get back because the last time they summoned withers while you were gone it escaped but tango and gems and joe's wither summons were, went perfect because you were there all right <laughs> who knows I'm, it says half joking maybe there's some uh merit there cvo with the prime shop and rjm 24 months Boyan says, I hate dishes. Thanks for the stream. Are you listening or watching the stream while you're doing dishes? Because I think that's awesome. I really do. Okay, so let's do this. So here's what I'm thinking. All right, so we know 100. Here's what we know, okay? we If you guys weren't here, we did some science. Actually, I kind of want to get this beacon active. Oh, I'm not going to be able to. I'm just going to do glass straight up. We're just going to do glass straight up. Or at least... Yeah, I'm gonna buy some glass and we're gonna do we're gonna put glass in here and go straight because this is where the beacon's gonna be. So as I'm building, I need to know to avoid uh that line. You know what I mean? You know what I'm talking about. Oh. Al says, uh Skiz, my husband and I just finished signing to purchase our first home. And I feel like I have to tell everyone now because I'm so excited. You need to enjoy this moment. Tell everybody. Tell people who you don't even know. Tell 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 animals. 
And you want to have some fun? Not only do I want you to tell total strangers, but at least once try it and just say it um, with no excitement, right? Like go to the grocery store, order like a pack of gum. Order something weird. Order a pack of gum, uh, a dozen eggs, um, a sponge, and uh, order, let's see, here, are you writing this down? Dozen eggs, sponge, um, garbage bags, napkins, and um, and an enema. And and take it through the uh, take it through the the cash. And when they charge you up or whatever, and they're just like, "Did you find everything okay?" Just say, "I did. I just signed on my first house. Have a good day." And just walk away. They're gonna be like, "Ah, oh, congratulations!" And then you get to enjoy that moment. And right now you're thinking, "This sounds like a terrible idea." Trust me. You do this, you're going to create a memory for yourself and them. Okay? I want you to do that. Did you do it yet? Go do it. Magnum says 100 bitty simply because you deserve these. You're amazing. Uh, Monkey Maniac with the nine months. Dumber two months. Keeping it amber. <laughs> the new Prime sub. Okay, so we're going to go. Are you guys ready for some things? Um we have to say omg a waffle that's right yeah do you want to do that too uh all right let's go let's go buy some glass um i could just use i have i have a good amount of glass i could just do i'm thinking here because eventually i'm gonna end up tearing it down let's just do no let's do it let's do dark glass for the time being just just so it, it keeps the a similar vibe that we're going to be dealing with, yeah? That's what we're going to go do. Bad Cap with 100 biddies. Happy Tuesday. You were massively missed when you were away, but you definitely deserved a break. I let, uh, at least once a month. I watch your words. Of, oh, at least once a month, I watch your words of affirmation in the live series, and it's always so wholesome. That's awesome. Thanks for that. Wesky with 1,000 biddies. Says, hey, Skiz, I'm moving back to Arizona. My alma mater offered me a scholarship, and I'm pretty nervous. Because it took me almost 20 years to get around to finishing my undergrad. Any advice? Uh, here's the deal. You're asking for advice about the fact that you're nervous. I mean, I want to respect the fact that you're nervous, but I don't under I My only advice is this. I have no advice for you because you shouldn't be nervous at all. You should be freaking proud. That's it. That's the only dynamic you should be feeling right now. Any sort of sense of, of nervousness. I don't want to be, I don't want to like, you know, begrudge you that or whatever. So you can't feel that way, but stop feeling that way. <laughs> right? Just be, just be proud. Okay. So let's buy, how much is this? We got two diamonds for a stack. That's easy peasy. So I'm going to get some black glass. This is unbelievable. I wish I was helping with whatever they're doing. Uh, okay. Pop pop. I wonder, let me go see if I sold, if I, if this is all gone. Okay, mangrove. All right, so we still have some. I wonder if people don't know I moved it over here. The, this thing, I, I people, I was putting mangrove in this chest, and the second I put it down, it turned into into five diamonds. Uh, I don't, and it's seven now. I raise I raise the prices. All right, this is all gone. Jeez, skiz, get your stuff together, man. Um, all these diamonds. All right, this is. I need. I am so the worst person ever. All right, well, we sold something. Ah, the mangoes. Not, I don't. I wonder if people know I'm over here. They got it right. What is there? Just random diamonds here. All right, I only need one stack. I only need one stack. I'll get back on the wood. I know I will. By the way, can it, who's whose glass shop is this? Because this has got to be the easiest shop to find. I love it. I like it a lot. I like it. This is ethos. Yeah. I like it. I, I, it's so crazy. Like it's so simple, but it's so memorable. Instantly me memorable. I like it. Oh, there's a thing right there. All right. Two. He said, yeah, pop, 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 pop. Give me uh, two diamonds per stack. Okay. And nobody's sleeping. Do I have the, I do look at this low. Oh, I love it. Etho, Hypno, and Cub. All right, all right. Do you know if anybody's selling beacons? 
I mean, I, I already broke the curse. Right? I already broke the curse, and I got my, uh... I got my... My thing. What are we laughing at? Oh, <laughs> that's a good point. <laughs> oh, boy. Is my face red. Oh, uh, let me sleep on that joke. That was very good. <laughs> Wow. You know, I, uh, I, I I had aspirations to be a detective once upon a time. I don't think that would have gone too well. All right, let me go in here and... <laughs> that was actually really, really funny. <laughs> Dang it! Okay, that means that this is going to be all dark and stupid. There's this glass there. What I can do is this. Let me take that off. And now there should be spots that are zero. See? No, I block. Wait, what? Really? Look at that. It still doesn't get down to zero. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. All right, very good. All right, so let's do this. Up. Ah! So we can put that back, and then it's going to go like this. So, again, the reason I... Oh, we should probably do this. Start recording. The reason we're doing this is because ultimately there will be a beacon here. Um, just because it'll be, it's really more of an aesthetic. And I haven't decided yet if uh, the beacon will um, have any sort of, what the? I haven't decided if the beacon will, you know what I mean? You know what I'm talking about. Oh, what am I trying to say? Dang it. I haven't decided yet if the beacon will have any sort of, uh, um, play in the pyramid or not. So it's only a matter of time before I'm going to build some sort of maintenance path to the beacon downstairs. You know what I'm talking about? Beacons don't work in tinted glass. Yes, they do. Actually, I'm just doing this so I know where it's at right now while I build, to be honest. I got to get that. That's going to make me crazy. Can I reach it? No, man. I don't want to do this anymore. Give me that. Okay. Off we go. Good for me. There it goes. Okay. Here's my bee nest. Okay. So th there should be no... There, I just want to double check one more time. There should be no spawnable area around here. And can I just say one more time how grateful I am that they... Remember when it used to be... I can't get over it. Remember the light level used to be seven? When you just use a temp block like dirt or moss instead of glass. Well, this is going to be where the, the beam goes. So as I'm building up, this layer, what we're about to make, is going to go up and down and all that. So I just want to stay keen on that, yeah? Okay, let's put some stuff away. Let's pause recording really quick. Now, here's what we want to do. This is the feel. This room. This is the feel, okay? I think it's only a matter of time before I actually... There'll be a roof on this eventually, prob on this one layer. Um, so it'll be even kind of darker in here. I think, like, if you go underneath here, it's going to be feel almost like this throughout. In any case, um, here's what I'm thinking, people. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually start the journey... It's going to come up a little bit. So I think I'm going to bring this black entryway out even further. And I think that it's going to slowly start to go up. And it's only going to start up one block. So I think what I'm going to do is I might just leave this entire plat bottom ground just intact. Yeah. Just totally, completely intact with where it's at right now. Don't you think? I got to be careful. If water comes down here, it's going to ruin everything. Place the wrong block where I built up to touch the B. Oh. What the? Oh, I sure did. Thank you. Thank you. Very smart. You are. All right. Here we go. Okay, so let's go get... Let's First of all, before we get started, let's get some more black concrete. I'm seeing this coming in a little bit further. Maybe out to about here. And then cutting left or something. So that's first things first. Let's bring in some more black concrete, which... You know... 
I'll be able to find Liggety Split because I'm very organized. This is my fault. It's my fault. It's my fault. It's my fault, people. All right, there's got to be some in here, right? Ouchie. Uh, okay. What are you doing? All right. Need black concrete. That's what we're going for. I know I have some somewhere, you know. Dude, that was really, really funny. Anybody sell beacons? <laughs> Ibbles is like, so you hear it too, right? <laughs> oh, boy. What's wrong with my soup? That's okay what I just did. It's okay what I just did. Okay, here we go. Get back in there. And the question is, what do we want to... Ouch! question is, what do we want to... Position am I up? What do we want to do once we come in here? I want to make sure I have the right blocks. Come into about here. And have you step up and over. And then we're kind of off to the races right here. And I'm feeling like it's going to be a combination of... It can't be leaves because there's going to be water. But a little bit of leaves... Uh, when they're where there's not water yeah I think this way we're gonna do uh, roots these right here right okay so let's do this let's go resume recording and let's start let's start to, let's get busy here yeah where is my spoon okay, so I'm gonna dig this up oh, I hate it that my spoon is so powerful I know. <laughs> See, he knows what's up. I was like, what is going on here? I bet if I asked Tango, what do you think they're selling? He'd know. Pop up. Ren's going away for two weeks tomorrow. Just overstocking the bacon shop. Ren's like the nicest guy ever. All apologizing. Don't apologize to us. You do your thing, homie. Now, we do need to be concerned about the entry here. Right. Oh, oh look at that, baby. Woo -hoo -hoo. All right. I'm coming through here. And then we're going to turn the corner here. We're going to go like this. Pop, 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 pop. Okay, we're going to come this way. Pop, 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 pop. Kind of feel I need to leave that there. Actually, let me see what this looks like. This is kind of cool. This is fun. Take that out. Take that out. Pop, pop, pop. And let's let's leave that like in there for a second. Oh my gosh, dude, this is not easy to work with because I can't see anything. Right? I'm gonna have to get some more concrete. That's for true. Okay, so as you enter, you're like, what am I? Yeah. Ooh. I like it. 21 boom booms remaining. Um. All right. So this is cool, right? Don't you think? So you come in, you enter and you're in just like this. Just kind of that's what I want. Just kind of an ominous feeling. Like, what am I dealing with? And as we go this way, I think I'm going to leave this open. Now it is a one. Hold on. I really should have gone one more so that that is in the center. Now this works. We can actually just go like this. I got to make more black concrete. I got to make more black concrete, everybody. Hmm. Lichen on the ceiling. I didn't even think about that. Oh. That's actually pretty cool, dude. All right. Well, th well we're gonna well we'll consider that later. Oh. Dude. All right. So let's go get more black concrete. 
And let's see, how do you make, how do you make black? I, I made all that black concrete and I already forgot how I did it. What is it? What do you do? I gotta get the black dye. And, and I need, how do you make concrete? It's like dirt and sand and clay. What is it? Gravel and sand. All right, gravel and sand. Thank you. Both of which I've got plenty. Finding them is another story. Hey, that's empty. Okay. There we go. Ooh. Ow! Monkey Maniac gift on over to repair. Thank you, Monkey Maniac. Kitten Cat. Or Kit the Cat. Kit the Cat says, hey, skids, it's my birthday today. I just wanted to share some love. I've been enjoying all your Hermitcraft videos since they always make me laugh. That's what we're going with, man. Happy birthday. Birthday. You, you, why you have a birthday? Happy birthday. Rug with the 32 months. Glad to have you back. My thoughts are with your daughter and your family. Thank you. You're wonderful. Ground furball. Cracking within. Milady, laugh a lot. <laughs> Wesky with the 500 biddies. Goodness gracious. Thank you, Wesky. Says uh, perfect, perfect skiz response. I hope it actually got through. I, I do. That's I know that stuff is easier said than done. I know that. You know what I'm talking about. Oh. All right. Here you go. You guys ready for greatness? Um, black concrete. Let's go. Okay, so I conquer so a stack and a half. I got more gravel. Oh, I ran out of uh, dye. I ran out of dye. I'm gonna need a lot of this stuff. Now keep in mind, this is gonna be very black going in, but as I'm like, you know what I mean? As I'm, as it starts to come together, I'm sure I'm gonna go back through and just sort of carve and and you know uh, polish up or whatever. What did you guys do with all my black dye? Hmm? I had a ton of it. What'd you do with it? I didn't have a ton. But I'm gonna go get some right now. That's for true. <sighs> Guys, my inventory. <sighs> Here's the thing. Here's the thing about inventory. Ailey Bun's like, I ate it. Oh, you ate my, you, now you ate it. As in you ate my black dye, or that was like slang for I hate it and I hate your inventory. I think it's the die. Here's the deal about all of this inventory nonsense. I don't understand how it happens. I don't remember putting anything in these spots here. Nothing. Okay. I don't remember putting a thing. So the worst thing I can do is make another double chest and uh, and, and make another junk drawer. That's the worst thing I can Oh, and I already had some on me. How about that? So I shouldn't do that. So I'll, uh, I'm going to do it for now, but then I'll think about it later. Okay. I'll be like, this is, this is worth thinking about my choices in life. i put this here. I don't need a hoe. Take this with me. Oh, I need that. Now we're, we're doing something here. Black concrete, black concrete. Slime. Away. Actually, slime's good to have for building purposes. Good. Are we good? Bring that. Okay. I need everything else. M M's, time to eat. Maybe if he can't run, he'll organize the chess. <laughs> I gotta give it to you guys on your Minecraft eating. Everybody who plays Minecraft, they make sure to eat constantly. Pretty impressive. I don't like you can't go without with a couple empty haunches for a little bit. Okay, now that I need squid, they're nowhere to be found. Really? Hi, right, look at that. As soon as I say that. I got looting three on this bad boy too, by the way. So let's see how much we're going to get. Let's see. We got how many, how much do you guys think I'm going to get? And what's up? We got four out of that, dude. Let's go. I hate killing passive mobs in this game. I don't know what my deal is. Huh. All right, we got 12 now. 
anymore. Oh, you said 13 and all. Yeah. And whoa. Okay, now we got 17. I mean, I'm going to keep going. Okay, we're going to do... We're going to kill... I, how many? We have 17 now. I predict after we kill these three, we're going to have... 26. Oh my gosh, okay. That's perfect. Right on target here. Uh, uh oh, oh man. I don't think I'm only going to get one out of... We got to get up. this guy here. You got to give me exactly one, dude, because I really want to be right, homie. What do we got? I was off by four. Okay, we got 30. Very grateful to Jem for this conduit. You know what I mean? What's up, fish? You know, like one of those fish that I just, that, that little school of fish I just swam through. Like one of them was like, he was like, they were like talking. He's like, so anyway, so I was, I was uh, getting some coffee at work the other day, right? And uh, maybe I should put this back up. I'm sorry, Jem. I can't. And then I go by, he's like, did you see that? And his, and his buddies are like, I'm trying to say the word what, but I can't say it with my face like that. He's like, that guy had a sword. And they're like, you're so paranoid. He's like, he had a sword. Look, he's killing all of our squid. And they're like, just relax. And he's like, you'll see. And uh, and then I'm going to go and he'll be the one I kill. And they're going to be like, he hired somebody to kill him just so he could be right. Being right is so important to this guy. And what do we got here? We got 42. That's pretty good. You know, a lot of this black dye. Something so satisfying about getting this done like this. I love that pathway, man. Okay. Milu with the 420. Drove a car for the first time today. It was so nerve-wracking. Your stream's helping me calm down. <laughs> so thanks for the stream. Well, that's exciting stuff, man. Honestly, I remember driving a car for the first time. You guys probably aren't going to want to hear this. Let's see. First time I drove a car, I believe I was nine. <laughs> I think it was nine. My older brother was like, you want to drive? I'm like, okay. So I did. I drove the car and, uh, and, and he, and like on traffic through intersections, my brother, I love him. He's not, he was not very re responsible, but we made it. We have not done the bop song yet. We will be doing the bop song. That is a staple of these streams. We will be doing it. Okay, we got to go make more concrete. Okay, this is where we do the thing where we do the stuff and the stuff and the thing, right? Hold on. I got gravel. I got sand. Oh, I didn't make any dye. Okay, that's my bad. Bop. Okay, now. Bop and bop. That's a lot, dude. That's a good amount right there. Now I got to take this fella here. We got to do this. And then we got to get our spoon in our hand, right? And we go like this, right? Oh, wait, I'm in, I'm in pick. Right? Like that. Yeah, baby. I feel like I'm losing a lot of it. Why is it flinging out so far? What is that? What is it flinging for? What you get in my pocket? You want to know what would just happen? You want to know what happened? All of this, uh, this concrete, they're talking. This guy right here is talking to these blocks. He's like, guys, trust me on this. When you turn into a hard block, leave. You do not want to be a part of this guy's inventory. Listen here, Mr. Block. Shut up. Um, okay. Uh, are we picking it up? I'm not grabbing any of it. All right. Good job. Get through all of it and then we'll pick it up. Look at this. 
man. That's very rude of these blocks. I'm trying to give them purpose. I don't want to do this. But I will. Is this how we have to do things? What does this say? Guys, we're being so patient about the noise. Beacons are half price for the week. <laughs> All right. Night. Let's see. Uh, okay. Let's get back to work here. Here we go. Is this going to work, you think? Oh, my gosh. I am so brilliant. It's important that you guys know that it's it's exhausting being this smart. Okay. Exhausting. Here we go. <laughs> Here we go. Yeah, baby. You can't escape anymore. I trapped you. Why is he saying no? <laughs> I was saying maybe I was going to buy like, I'm going to buy them out at half price and then I'll sell it for 75% of their normal price. That would not be cool. Okay. This song I'm listening to has what sounds like a creeper sound in it. Look at these jerks came way out here. What is happening? Why are they pops? Is it because I'm so strong? Is that what I'm dealing with here? Huh? Dang it. That was terrible. All right. And here we go. Let's get back to work here. We have that powder. Okay, still more to go. Only four more to go here. You get in there and we keep going. Look how it's going through the glass. Have you been eating strength strawberries? Ooh, no, but if I was Popeye and I had to pick a food, that would make me go, you know, um, it would not be spinach. Um, let's see. Strawberries will work. Maybe some pizza. Uh, maybe a chalupa. There you go. That's my that's my character. I'm in Popeye where it's a chalupa is what gives me super super strength. All right. Now let's go. I'm going to leave that there for now in case I need to reuse it. Is that was that scar trying to hawk eye me? Trying to hawk eye me, are you? Hmm? Hey! Oh, those are cool looking. Why won't you talk to me? Scar. Oh, give it a go. Did he, oh, he gave me something. Okay. He says, give it a go. Let's do this. Oh, was, okay. Here we go. Is it going to backfire on me? Why aren't you talking to me? Here we go. Ready? I want to say. <laughs> I was going to. So here we go. Oh, that is too cool. That is too cool. That is too cool. How come no talkie? Don't do it. Ooh. Woo. <laughs> that is a very interesting place to do that. That is a really cool firework. How come no talkie? Why won't he talk? Why didn't he talk? Those are the eclipse rockets. Those are really cool. All right, moving on. So we come this way and we turn and we're going to go just a little bit more. I think I'm going to come. I'm going to come further. I want to get further away from the door. So we're going to. 
paste a little bit more. Just a little bit here. Bop, bop. Bop. I guess we can, we don't need to have solid ground. We can do this. Yeah, that does, that, that pulls off the same thing. We're going to put some lichen on the roof or something. Don't you think? Oh, this is so... Black concrete's not easy to work with, man. We could just leave it like that. We don't need to do a full roof. Right? Let's save on, on materials here. Let's go a little bit more. Let's get to about here. And then I think we're going to probably step up a bit. And then we're going to start doing the, the water path. That's going to come this way. Come around. Oh, no, 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 no. It's got to turn earlier than that. I think it's going to turn this way because I want a lot of opportunity to go left and right. Right? Yes. Yeah, so we're going to turn right here. Okay. You guys know, you know, you know what I'm talking about. Oh, right. We're going to turn right here is where we're going to turn. Okay, clear this up. Oh, I don't. I didn't need to do that actually. Um, actually, gosh darn it all. Oh, that no, that's fine. That's fine. Okay, so this is gonna do this. This is what we need to clear out. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. I can see it wanting to turn this way. Okay. Now, is this, this is a one wide coming in. Now, what I am worried about, what I am worried about, thank you for the hot mic. <laughs> Bop, I turned it off before you said, if only he read chat. <laughs> what I am worried about is, is people seeing too much of these. Uh, and then like, like knowing the path, right? Because what I'm envisioning here is going to be, it, once you turn and you go up or whatever, you're going to walk a little bit and then you'll be like, oh, the only way to move forward is to swim through this one wide. And then as you go, you're like, oh, then turn here and you realize that's a dead end and you're in trouble. So there will be a certain degree of, of, you know, memorizing the pattern, if you will, uh, that we got to be cool with. So we go bop, bop, and let's turn here. Okay, so now once we turn here, we're going to go up. Now, what's the best way to do that? Is there a way to see it? Oh, I, I'm just going to do... Can we do... We're going to do like black. Dude, this is crazy. This is all... Like, it's just the entrance and it's messing with me. And and it's not going to be just this. Guys, here's another thing to know about, right? Once I'm all done with this, there's going to be... What I'm planning on is as you come in, there will be occasional signs that sort of are designed to give you a certain amount of words that let you know where you're at. You know what I mean? That you're like, you know, how you're already starting to feel the walls close in on you. You need that air and you need that. I need to find, you know, very scarce food and stuff like that. So that's going to be all things that we do later. But in terms of what we're doing now, let's do this. Let's get, um, let's go get some steps really quick. Some... Like Blackstone, right? Oh, that was terrible flying. Terrible. We're gonna, to, we're gonna have to find a way to work in some wither heads and stuff, right? <laughs> okay. Where is all of my black, not Blackstone, but uh, Deep Slate's pretty good. I really do prefer Blackstone stairs. Uh, all right, we'll start with this. I thought I had more Blackstone than this. Darn it, I really did. I thought I had... That's all Deep Slate. If I have to use that, that's okay. Let's try them both, see how they both look. Was there not just a duck right here? How did you get over there so fast? All right. 
All right, now let's grab this guy here. Let's try Blackstone first. Come this way, clear that out, and let's do a little bit of that. Woo! So dark. And then right here is when we're going to go up. Just a little bit here, so go up right there. And what does that look like when I... Oops! Didn't mean to do that. What are you doing over here? I didn't put that guy there. So dark. It wasn't just a phase. This is not... You know what? I was into the... When I was in high school, dude. I, I was into the dark stuff, dude. Not dark. That's not the right word. But I, I did the whole... I had, so first of all, you guys know I'm a drummer. And... Uh, you guys know that. You know I'm a drummer. I was in a rock band and all that, and I used and I had long hair, and uh, I used it one time. I not I didn't do it a lot, but one time I dyed it jet black, and I used to have really thick hair. I dyed it jet black. It was so black that in the sun it looked a little bit. Uh, it looked a little. Uh, it looked a little blue. <laughs> it really did. It looked blue in the sun. I think we are going to have to put the occasional lichen up here. Otherwise, we're going to get a jerk. Actually, I'm almost wondering if I should put proper lights on here for now, just so I can see what I'm doing. And then tear it down later. Huh? Huh? Could be. I don't know. I think I might do that, because I can't see anything. Let's go get... Um, Ah, uh, it doesn't matter. I need to resume it anyways. Let's get... Ah, oh, I put him away. <laughs> so bad. Oh, okay. Let's go ahead and grab these guys here. And just so we have some... Look at my inventory already, everybody. Are you looking? See that? You guys don't remember me putting anything down on. Huh? You don't know. 90s skater boy. I I was never a skater. I mean, I did I did like to skate. I did. I like to do skateboard and stuff, but I was I don't think I ever would have fit the bill of skater. Unless unless it was a skater boy and you know Avril song. Then I'm in. All right, let's go. Let me get up here. Let me go up here and let's let's put these. Let's do these really quick. Just ah, just give me a little bit more light. This will, now this was this is a good idea because this will be easy uh, to tear down later. You know what I mean? So we're just gonna do this for now. We'll tear them down as we go. But this just helps give me a little bit more visibility. Not even a lot either. That black concrete really swallows it up, doesn't it? Okay, okay, okay. All right, so we're gonna come up now, and it's time to go one block high. So we gotta come up here. So we're gonna do that. Okay, so we're going to come up, which means everything needs to come up uh, one more higher. It's the only way it's going to work. This is not easy, dude. It's hard to see what I'm looking at here. Okay. So I don't want to tear this out, but I don't think I'm going to have a choice, to be honest. We are going to go one higher here. Okay, good. Oh, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. That reminds me. Now now it's time. I actually want to mix this in a little bit. I want to mix some of these in a little bit. And I said I would do this stuff later. And I will. But I think we're going to slowly transition into it. I'm going to have to be careful about the lighting as I, as I move, as I progress forward here, you know? I feel like I should put, should I put like a half, like a slab on there? Whoa, I almost knocked over my coffee, dude. Tego has a texture pack for building with black concrete. Maybe ask him about it. Okay. Not a bad idea. Not a bad idea. So these are mangrove. Why say muddy roots? Like I should put mud underneath that, you think? That would be probably a lot more fitting to have actual proper mud under that, right? 
I wish I could put something here and it not... Oh, it just destroyed the lichen is all it really did. Muddy Roots is a block. I think there's a mud shop in there. It's an entirely different route, you're saying? Let's go, let's go back to the, let's go back to the shop real quick. See if there's something we can purchase over there. Let's go over there. Let's do it. Who's this? Etho! Meow! <laughs> All right, where is, uh, where, where am I at? Here we go, go this way. This thing looks like a Nintendo. It looks like an NES system. All right, we want a mud shop, but I'm never gonna find it. I'm not even sure I want to do this. I just like, I just wanna try it. Near the nether portal. I love how much you guys know. I love it. Oh, there we go. Beautiful. Okay. Okay. The little mud hut. <laughs> this is great. All right. Money mangrove roots. These are uh, these are these are different than what I got. They're they're darker, huh? What the heck? Oh, that's my boots. Oh, that's the brown note. There's some mud. All right, three diamonds for two stacks. There's some mud bricks. I don't need any of those. Packed mud, no. All right, let's let's uh let's what is it? What is it? Three for two. <laughs> I missed Pearl. What did Pearl say? Who did I miss? What did Pearl say? <laughs> what did I miss? Oh, I walked right by her, did I? Where's Poppers? Who's... Who's doing the brown note? Isn't that the brown note? <laughs> Where's Burly Poppers? You guys said I walked right by her. Pearl! That's Etho. This looks nothing like Pearl. Uh, you know, if I grow my hair a little longer, maybe. All right, all right. Now, where'd Etho go? I'm here and I walked right... I, I know. Where did, where's Pearl? I'm here and I walked right by her. Who is doing that? I don't know, but it sounds like the brown note, dude. <laughs> it does. It really does. <laughs> I want to know who's doing it. This is cool. What's it? What do you have to skiz? Uh, I am just designing the interior of uh, the first layer. And it is, it is, it's a oh, okay. slow process. Well. I spent all day yesterday, or all stream yesterday, rather. Just creating the mood and getting the right perfect level of light with the lichen so it's dank, but there's no chance of spawning. And now I'm going in and, and building on top of that and just trying to make uh, make the entrance. It's supposed to be kind of a terrible experience trying to get from layer one to layer two. Oh, so you are actually carrying the theme of the pyramid yep. to the interior as well. Yeah, just to, yeah. So since the first layer is, the, is physiological, you're going to be starving and drowning. Right, because this food and air and all that, just the whole time trying to get to level two, it's gonna be, it's gonna be. Oh, very that's hard. why you did the science experiment. That's oh, right. Now it's all making sense. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So now I know that you can go about a hundred blocks before you die in water. So I'm gonna dial it back a little bit because turns and stuff are gonna slow you down. It's gonna be kind of a have a maze feel, like like a maze while swimming underwater in a one wide and temporary breaks here and there, and there might be a little bit of food to keep you going and stuff like that. Right. Uh, we'll see. Oh, that's cool. Should be neat, hopefully. All right, man. I don't know where Pearl is, but I'm here and I walked right by her. Hmm. See, you guys are trolling me. Uh, all right, let's get back in here. And then let's go 
Um, let's do this. Let's go. Let's do this, people. Let's go. Let's go ahead and grab. Let's grab two of these. Right? Let's grab two of those. And then how much are these? Three diamonds for a stack. And we'll grab a stack of these and we'll do that. Pop, pop, pop. Yeah, good. I think that's pretty good. Just to get us going and see. How hey, there's Pearly Pop. I'm here and I walked. I walked right by you. How are you? You did walk right by me. You stared right into my eyeballs and you're like, yep. All right. That's it. I'm so sorry. I, I'm so oblivious sometimes. How are you, Pearls? Oh, I'm pretty good. How you doing? Excuse me. Good. Good to see you back, man. Yes. Thank you. It's, I'm, uh, it's good to be back. Two days mm. in a row streaming. I'm feeling good. Oh, my gosh. Look at you working. I know. You're getting there. It's almost like Let's I'm go. serious. I know, right? <laughs> I need your mailbox coordinates at some point, so. Uh, can we go get them right now? We can, but I'll, t I'll give you a deal. You come look at what I made, and I can we can go get your coordinates. I love it. Lead the way. Okay. Come this way. Okay. <laughs> I, I just want your opinions, right? I, I would love your, your honest opinion on this. Give me the full critique, you know, be as harsh as you want, but. Uh, okay, I mean, you know this is like a pilot asking a toddler, what do you what do you think of my flying skills? All opinions matter, no matter what. Okay. A pair of eyeballs is a pair of eyeballs and you've got your own opinions and I love them. Okay, so. I can dig it. <laughs> All right, go. What do you think of my big red truck? This is your big red truck? Okay. Yeah, All right. it's not hauling a Christmas tree, but it's a big red truck. Okay, my first my, my first impression is this. My very first one. Mm -hmm. If I made this, I would it would be the thing that I, I would be like, this is the best thing I've ever made in my entire life. And here's why I say oh, that. Because oh. well, I can notice instantly it's a truck. I, you wouldn't even be able to be able to tell that it's a truck if, if I made it. So this is no, no. I like it. It is you this, give yourself more credit. No, no, no. <laughs> oh, I'm just very real. This is I it's a total nasty, dirty pickup truck. Oh it is. I would love to see a pig back here. Just like a just, pig, yeah, an actual pig in the bed of the truck. Okay, okay. <laughs> I mean, that would actually that would fit the same. I don't know if I could fit one, but I could try and put yeah. one in there. I don't know if he would sit still or not, but uh, but no, I that like would actually it. be really yeah. cute. I need to do that. See, look, see, everybody has things they can add to stuff. Hey, you know, I Give help more credit. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna get a pig. <laughs> yeah, the pig's it, gonna help sell flowers. <laughs> this is good, and then maybe I am seeing. I mean, even my chats. Are, oh yeah, there's your tail lights right there. There, let's go. Yeah. I got a little redstone ones this time. I usually do glass. And I'm like, you know, I'm going to do the little boop, little boop lights, you know? <laughs> the little, little cutie boop lights. Little boop lights. <laughs> little boop lights. I love it. And you can go in. You can drive it. Just, it just, you don't need a steering wheel though, right? Now, is this a standard Look. clutch or double clutch? Because I, I haven't, uh, I've never done a double clutch. Let's call it a double clutch because that makes it more complicated for you. It's yes. totally a double clutch. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Where's the keys? Is How this... you doing? <laughs> I would love to drive it yeah. if this thing started. You know, what's funny is that if it was like Etho or Tango that moved it, I'd be like 80% sure it actually drives. Oh my gosh. <laughs> if, if only I could make that actually do a thing, that would be so cool. Sadly, sadly not. I love it. Aesthetic. I really do. Thank you. Yeah. All I'm right. going to be selling flowers soon. So if you want any flowers, specifically all kinds of flowers, Ooh. come here for your flowers. All right. Yeah. And dice. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Very good. Very good. All right, okay. come with me. Yeah, let's go see this. this place. You, uh, is she behind me? My rockets are failing there, me, man. There we go. I was like, <laughs> where'd she go? <laughs> Australian rockets. It's all right. Yeah. All right. Oh, so here's gosh. what I'm thinking on where we're going to uh -huh. end up uh, putting it, which I'm very excited about it, by the way. Also, I don't know if I should yes. say this out loud on stream, but I'm going to do it. I still got to run it by Sir Scar. Um, mm -hmm. I think we might be begging for our own mailbox at the permit office, maybe, so that people can get official a mail. Yeah, I maybe. Mean, there is one in the top door to the permit office. There's one in the shopping district. You said. Let me come over there. I'm running out of rockets. <laughs> um, yeah, there's one in the uh, the trophy shop that Zuma made. There's one inside that. Okay. Okay. If well, you. We'll get it if sorted. you guys combine into uh, using that for the permit office, yeah. that could probably work. Or we just move it a little bit. <laughs> so I was That's thinking work for the mailbox, mm -hmm. I was literally thinking just like right here. Just right here? Facing yeah. outwards this direction? Yep. Into the wall basically? Cover up your hole? 
Yep. Cover up my, yeah, I, I want it just cause I don't want to fill in this hole. That's <laughs> No, okay. I'll get you want us to fill it in for you. Okay. <laughs> no, I'm thinking, oh I don't remember what the dimensions are, but I was thinking I'll just put these here to get us started. Like, as yeah, I, re just... I reckon that'll fit in just fine. Um, It's only like a seven by six type situation. Seven by six. Okay, so you want it poking out a little bit? I was saying, uh, what do you think? What do you think? Let me see. I, I think it'll look good, like embedded into the wall. Okay, so, like, okay. Kind of, kind of, kind of make it either stick out by one or flush with this bit. I can dig that. I like what you just said. Let's do that. Which which one would you prefer? Would you prefer it poking out a little, or you prefer it flush? I uh, flush. Flush sounds awesome. Flush. Yeah. Okay, we can do that for you then. I'll, I'll let Ethan know. I mean, you just talked to him. <laughs> I did. <laughs> Sorry. I did. <laughs> Thank you, pearls. Oh my gosh. Oh, good. Oh, good. I just had to get that from you because then you're the last person left and then you got all the cherry mountain hooked up and then you guys can do whatever you like. <sighs> Send a mail to each other. Go That's crazy. Cool. I love it. And I got to tell you something. <laughs> I still yeah. to this moment, try as I might, I cannot make sense of I cannot I cannot make sense of how they did this. Uh, uh, it's how, magic. It, it's, <laughs> it, it, it's so much so that the number of uh -huh. portals that I've made on this server is goose egg because I'm that convinced I'm going to destroy the whole system if I make a portal. I'm like deathly ah. afraid. I'm going to. I'm not. I'm going to nah. ruin Look, you're on a mountain, man. As long as, you're, as long as you make it above Y75, you're fine. Mm. It won't link up. It'll be all good. Yeah. All right. See? Just be above that. Load of confidence. <laughs> I like it. Yeah, you got this. Hey, you making the interior of your pyramid. Yeah, I just, just now started... Uh, just a few blocks, mm. but tell me if you feel at least a little bit of hopelessness walking into this entry. Hopelessness. Okay, that's that's just what I like to experience little, yeah. at 9.30 in the morning. Yeah, just I like <laughs> to be hopeless in my day. Just a little bit. A little bit of hopelessness. It's very, it's very dark in here. It's very Dear dark. Me. Yeah, it's very, and it's going to finally oh turn. The, and, then, and then that's it. And then up uh, here, now you're going to go into a one wide water swim. That's going to... A what? Yep. One wide water okay. swim. Okay. I mean... If you want to make people feel hopeless, maybe like, <laughs> you know, kind of make them panic a little bit, start drowning them a tad, you know, to get through the entire thing. They that, might not make it. Maybe they will. I don't know, but I'll make me feel pretty hopeless if that, I couldn't swim. That's why we, <laughs> we did, I did science yesterday with impulse to see how long can a uh -huh. person swim before they're dead. And it turns out about 102 blocks and that's just in a straight Hundred line. Yeah. Okay. Exact. All right. I mean, that's one way to do it. I yeah. mean, I can tell you now, Tango would probably be a good expert on that. Yeah, I probably There's plenty from you, last season. <laughs> okay, you you want to know what? You ready for this? I uh, did not yeah. ask Tango to help me, and it's for this exact reason. Uh, I wanted to run the experiment, oh. but if I was like Tango, I want you to help me determine. I'm going to build a one wide channel of water. Tell me how long it's going to be until somebody. I would have gotten mm -hmm. that far. He would have been like 102 blocks. Like he would like known instantly, <laughs> and I'm like, you just ruined the experiment. So I wanted like to do the science myself. <laughs> fair enough, mate. Fair enough. Yeah. See, Ooh. this is why, like, you, you get folks that it maybe give you slightly longer knowledge to go off, you know? Yep, yep, Make yep. something cool out of it. You See, know? that's what I'm talking about. I Oops. mean, well, I can definitely say you're in the right direction. <laughs> All right, I'll give good. you that. Thank you, Pearl. This little bit. Though. This is good. This oh, you're is, welcome. I'm going to be lost in here for a while, but I'm going to be, wait, is this? Oh, I didn't even Are see you that. A block? Yeah, there you go. How come you, <laughs> I couldn't even see it. Thank you. I'm tuned to blocks, mate. It's my job. You are. It's my job. <laughs> uh, okay, uh, I'll leave you to it then, excuse me. <laughs> all right, poppers, you take you take it easy. Talk to you soon. You too. Goodbye now. Bye. <laughs> Is she the one doing it? <laughs> it's been you this whole time? That's the brown note. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Now let's go. So let's get back to work here. And we're going to grab, I'm going to go ahead and mute. Ow. Cheeky pearly pop. Uh, okay, no problem. No problem. If you're watching, no problem. Uh, okay. There was something else I wanted to pay attention to. So Sir Scar was in chat and I just missed it because I'm blind. Let me see. What, what did Sir Scar say? There we go. We need one. So, yeah, 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 yeah. So, he's into it. He's into it. Okay. Yeah, because essentially, when the popo gets active, 
uh, there are some breaches that we have to address, and I like the idea of it have having official popo um, mail. Yeah. All right, let's go. Let's put this guy muddy mangrove roots. That is interesting looking. Let me let me take a peek at this. Huh. I kind of like that look. I like that better than it being over the grass. So anywhere I put uh, one of these roots, I'm going to put the other stuff underneath. All right. So check it out, everybody. You're watching? Watch. Watch harder. All right. So we said we're going to do this. And bop, bop. The idea is that it's just going to get a little bit more aggressive and then boom, you're going to be out. Now, I'm not going to be able to put these as the water channel, as you can imagine, because... Cause, cause it's going to waterlog them. So I'll use the roots as the base of the water channel, right? That could be cool. Bring this out like this. Okay. Now what we're going to want to do is, oh man. So right around here, it's going to be time. It's going to be just about time. So I'm going to dig this out a little bit more. Go a couple more. Ah, poopy. I don't like it when that happens, by the way. Just as my shovel's too amazing. It's too amazing. Okay, this is good. Up, up. And let's go. Let's do one more. Do one of those. And let's do this. I didn't need to dig that bottom one out. But now it's time to go to commit to three blocks worth of the money mangrove. And the roots on top. Okay. Sort of transitions into it a little bit. And then it's time to do the blocks because we're going to be swimming. Let me tell you something I really like. That I This is kind of a happy accident. You guys realize that if I take away one of these lichens, this is what's amazing. You take away one lichen, right? And you still can't get low enough for spawnage, which is fantastic. But that also means that if I take away two lichens, then this will turn something around here will be zero. So, oh, I got to tell you, I'm really liking lichen. I don't think for one second that I'm the first person to say that. Okay. Is the XP bank ready? Not ready yet. It's almost ready. Um, I'm going to tell you right now. Not going to give too many spoilers right now. It's almost ready. And the heavy lifting of the, the, the redstone piece obviously was, was impulse. And shh, I got a little sneak preview. Looks like there's a little bit more work to be done, but I got a little sneak preview and it is impressive. Very impressive stuff. All right. So here's, I'm doing it this way because this is where the water channel is going to be. And I feel like. I take that, that would be too. If I took this out, I feel like we're going to have spawnable area over here. Isn't, I need to get the texture pack that does the lights on the ground. No, I guess. Oh, this is messing it up. Yeah, this is going to mess with me. I got to be careful here. See this? Ooh. Look at that, people. Okay. Gotta make sure there's no mobs. Up. Oh! Ooh. Let's give me water on it anyways. Ow. I know there's a mod for that, right? There's a mod to... I just don't have it. I'm gonna have to make sure I get that. Okay, so we're gonna come this way. And right around here is gonna be where we're going to do our first uh, dump into the water. Okay. Yeah, that's gonna be good. I really do need that. Now, even though these can be as dark as we want them to be, but it's this is this is one of the reasons we doubled up, right, on light and uh, the carpet because it's just completely unspawnable, which is good. Okay, so right here is where we're gonna we're gonna get started. So let's let's start to feel this out. Deep slate redstone ore. I'm so sorry that I do not have. I do not have that, my friend. 
50 to 100, that's a lot, dude. That is a lot. I gotta go check. I didn't resume recording. I don't think I'm gonna include this part or something. Maybe I will. Um, let me go check real quick. Oh, never mind. Pearl's on it. How does somebody just have that? Oh. Just borrow from Mountain or Mountain. That or Mountain is ridiculous. Okay, gotta be careful here because it's gonna be spawnable if we're not careful. Oof, right there. That's spawnable right there, people. That's no good. Okay. We're gonna have to put some like in here, which I know I'm not liking. Really, let's move let's move this guy right there instead. All right, good. Now it's time to swim. Now it's time. Well, I, well, I was going to swim starting. Never mind. I'm an idiot. I was going to start swimming right here, wasn't I? Yeah, we're going to start swimming right here anyways. Okay. Okay, so here we go, people. So if we go bop, bop, bop. What do we want to be above it? I think it's okay have roots above it maybe as you're what you're swimming underneath yeah let's get a trap door let me get a trap door oh my gosh this is gonna be <sighs> this is gonna be a long i didn't hit resume again this is gonna be a long time coming oh what's well, too easy to break Lichen on the side of transparent roots provides light. Lichen does stop water. That's why it's right there. Yep. Um. What did I come out here to get? Oh, a trapdoor. I want to make a trapdoor real quick. Uh, I have no wood on me. Up. Oh, make a pink one. I don't think so. We need something darker than that. I want to go a dark, dark one. That should not hurt my feet when I land so softly. Okay. Okay, let's go over here. I know I have some dark. There we go. Dark oak. And uh, let's get a trap door. A couple of them. And I'm going to need also, I could do lichen on the ground. That'll stop the water flow. I'm going to have to make some more lichen pretty soon here, folks. Ow! I'm a better flyer than that. Okay. Okay, so let's... Now let's take some lichen and put it here. And that's going to be where the water flow is right here. Right? Which means that's where the water starts. Then this is where the trap door is. Oh, and then you're off to the races, dude. <gasps> Woo! -hoo! Woo! All right. So we get, the water's got to be, it's got to be your bowl. Right? This will stop. Wait, that's a regular route. What am I? These are regular roots. We can't start start until here. I'm an idiot. Hold on. Yeah, I'm a chunky monkey. Hold on. I got to eat. Oh, he's hungry, man. What am I going to eat tonight? What should I have to eat? For, uh, here's what I have for lunch. For lunch, I had, like, What's that bread called? Lavash? Like a lavash bread? Bacon and eggs. I don't eat bacon anymore. I miss bacon, but I don't eat anymore. People are saying fajita noodles. We had some ribs and some rice. Mmm. Chicken parm. Not focaccia. It was a lavash. Lavash type bread. It's like a really thin, low carb bread that I covered in uh, tzatziki and chicken. A little bit of Cholula sauce. Really good. 
And let me tell you this, this is, this is, I'm such a chump when it comes to my dogs. Okay. Would you like to hear why I would say such a thing? I gave them their food and I'm not just like, Oh, here, you eat your pebbles. I give them like, we spend a lot of money on dog food. I want my dogs to have healthy food and I have a hundred dogs. So it is up there. So we got, we get them really good food. And I also mix their dry food with wet food, but they're just like stick up their cute little dog noses at it. It's just not good enough for them. So they don't always eat. It makes me sad. So what did I do? I made myself the little lavash and tzatziki roll up today with chicken and tzatziki. And you want to know what I did? Because I'm going to tell you. I uh, gave them some chicken. I put chicken in their food. And, the, and, the, and one of the main reasons I did was because Drax, I think he's got an upset tummy. I think I'm mixing too many different dog foods or something. So I just, not a lot of chicken. I just gave him a little bit of chicken. It makes him so happy. Um, but I'm having my pool drained. And because of that, I had to have the dogs locked inside and I was working. I was on work meetings and Drax who never goes to the bathroom inside laid a big old plop downstairs on the tile. And I, I was saw it and I was like, there's just, Oh, such a mess to clean up. And I'm like, Oh my gosh, I felt so bad. And he looked at me and he's a puppy and he always looks sad because he's part great Dane. I told him that is not your fault, dude. That is my fault. That is my fault. So I cleaned it up and then I felt so bad for him. So I just had to do something for him. I'm a total chump when it comes to my dogs, people. I'm that is not lost on me. Okay, here we go. Uh, where the where to go? Where's the doors? Doors, 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 doors. All right, let's do this. Ready? So we go bop. That's that's incorrect. Thank goodness it was on the tile. I dude, seriously. So I. I'm gonna tell you this right now. When I bought this house, the entire bottom floor is all tile and most of the upstairs is. And I was like, yep, I'll take it because of my animals. <sighs> it's no good. Okay, so here we go then. Okay, so that means that the water's gonna come. It's gonna start right here. Okay, so you're gonna come up and be like, oh my goodness, what are we doing? And then you're out here. Here you go. And you gotta start going. Okay, so one, two. So now let's start, let's start piecing this together. I really do like the idea of using Muddy Mangrove do I want to do only Muddy Mangrove as the floor? Or do we want to mix it a little bit? I'm kind of torn here. Right now, we're going to do just the Muddy Mangrove, okay? So here's what we got to do. So one, how many was that, people? I can't get back in there now. How much, how many? Dang it! Yeah! Okay, so this is... Uh, Here we go, ready? One, two, three, four, five... So we're at five right now. Let's go six, uh, seven, eight, nine. We want to make the actual path that we're going to do first. And then once we've done it, then we can have these little things that trail off into other areas to get people lost or whatever, right? Uh, six, seven, eight, nine. Uh, let's go 10, 11, 12, 13. This is crazy because... This has the capacity to be pretty big deal here. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 6, 37, 38, 39, 40. This doesn't have to be exactly 102 or anything in fact i would be hard pressed to make this even like 90 and 90 blocks long because at 60 you're going to start feeling some pain right so here's 40 41 42 43 44 45 46 47 48 49 uh 50 51 52 53 54 55 56 58, 59, 60. Now, right here is when you're going to start experiencing bubbles, right? Right around 60. This is what we learned yesterday. It's kind of a maze. It is kind of a maze, but it's going to be a little bit more than that. I plan on there being, um, it's going to have a maze feel, but it's not just about it being a maze. I, I plan on there being certain areas of re like reprieve, right? Certain areas where you can kind of make almost like a checkpoint. You're like, oh, and you can get your air. Maybe th there might be some snacks there or whatever, right? 
So here's 60. So now you're starting to you're starting to suffer, right? You're starting to suffocate at this point. I gotta tell you, I really do love having B dubs on the server. This is very nice. Uh 60. All right, so 70. I'm sorry, 61, 62, 3, 4, 5, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72. And I think right around here, we're going to open this up. This is going to be something that is like, okay, you, you made it, right? So this is, why didn't I do this? This is like you made it, right? All right, so we, we have some work to do here, but this is like you you, ba you basically made it. So let's let's do this right. Uh, I am going to do this, folks. We know that this is going to end up being... I can't believe I almost did that. Um, what is in my... Yeah, black concrete. That's what I want. Okay. And let's take that out. Okay, here we go. All right. So, so this first one, so this first little trek here, now here's the other thing is that it's not going to be like, oh, just go down the path and you're good. I want there to be like, like kind of, like I said, maze esque so that you, you're going to be in a zone where you're like, dude, uh, did I just make a bad turn? I want people, I may or may not want people dying a lot, <laughs> right? Once they're doing this, I kind of want there to be like, that's what I want. I think it'd be great. Um, okay. I think that'd be great. That was my answer. I think that'd be great. Okay. Dang it. I think I'm going to end up buying stress out. I think I'm going to, did I, wow. I'm going to need really. Okay. Now we know, because I think, well, let me see. Do I like this? I feel like I do. I feel like I, I like the idea of it being this that you're swimming through uh, with the occasional lichen on top, right? Okay, and we are going to, okay, let's, let's do this. Let's go get some more. We got to get some more. You want some more? Uh, definitely a bed. Yeah, there there will be the yeah the bed and the stuff like that. That's going to be a lot of finishing touches. And again, as hopeless as this is coming in, it's really more dark. The hopelessness at the end. I really want it to be signs that you read on the way in. You know what I mean? That you're just like, what am I in for? Oh, can I share something with you guys? Can I share something? I'm gonna do this. You guys go with that. Here it comes time to share. Uh, I'm having like the greatest time ever. I'm in the greatest time ever because like Tango did this and he did the decked out and, and I'm never going to be able to build anything that can come even touch the ballpark, but I don't care. Like this is too much fun. You know what I mean? Ban this fool says purple ban me. What are you talking about? Uh oh, what 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 buns? What happened? What I miss? Buns, and see what I mean? <laughs> no, not you. Oh, gotcha. Yeah, my mods are the greatest. Parts for mods. What did I miss? I don't even care. That's the whole point of it. My mods are as just as incredible as I get. Bun says it's okay. I'm teaching someone to behave or get yeeted. <laughs> <laughs> and I really enjoy this about Buns too. I feel like uh, Buns's radar on what's bannable and what's not is right in line with myself. Okay. Okay, you guys ready for awesomeness? So how much we got here? So this is... Gosh, I feel like I... Did I get mud? I did. There's some mud. I should have been using some of this as well. And I didn't get enough of this. But it's time. It's time. I'm going to get even more. Let's get... Let's get four more stacks. Right? You guys think four more stacks would be good? Let's do four more stacks. So bop, 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 bop. I can't believe I just did that. That's very embarrassing. Oh, no. There we go. And there you go. All right. So I don't have the room for this. <laughs> so 
So like now I'm just littering in her place because that's how special I think I am. Um, no more room. Guys, you were right there. Right there when I emptied my pockets. Are you seeing what I'm dealing with here? I'm very upset. But I'm going to get through it. All right, let's go get more. Give me that. There we go. There you go, Stressy. Also, I owe stress a, a present, don't I? Yeah, ender chest or maybe my shulker box I could use for... Where's my shulker box? <gasps> I put it away. And that thing's loaded with arrows, dude. <laughs> Ready? Two more shots. And let's see if I can just float into my bedroom. What is the next podcast? You know what? It's Tuesday. I can tell you. You want to know? And I'm also going to tell you this. I haven't even started editing it yet. Because that's how I literally was only had the time to get the footage onto my computer right before a stream. The next podcast will be Scott Major. We got him on the show. And he, as you can expect, what a delight. Yeah, some people knew in chat. Oh, I, that was, I freaked out because I put my head between those spikes. Yeah, so we got Scott Major on the show. Very excited. Oh, he impulse revealed. Yeah. The best hugger he is, which that was my time. I'm, I'm second place. I'm second place, people, on the planet. Silver medal for hugging. I, I, I was first place. Nobody gives a hug like me, man. Even my own mother-in-law told me that. Nobody gives a hug like me. I have been I have been dethroned because I got to give uh, Scott a hug in in, in uh, Vegas when we were there for TwitchCon, and I'm like, oh, is this what it's like to hug me? It's glorious. All right, uh, let me put some stuff away because you guys made a big old mess. Actually, where is? Yeah, look at that. That's all my fireworks. People. <laughs> um. Why is this? What have I done? What have I done? How is this? How are all all this glass named this? Did I take the wrong stack? That was designed to me to say what the price is. <laughs> what have I done? <laughs> Club says, I hope you're doing well. I hope your daughter is recovering well. Keep up the good work. I've been a fan for quite a while now. Thank you for your content. Club, thank you for that. All right. No, <laughs> no, Joe's just like that. He names all of his glasses. And now I can't stack it properly. Okay, that's okay. Uh, let's do this. That's deep slate. Okay. I cannot. I'm going to put, I'm not shooting anybody right now. Let's put that away. I uh, don't need the, don't need that. Don't need that. I don't really need that. That's something I'll do those touches later. Yeah. Put away the moss carpet. I'm just digging carpet up at the, for the time being. Need to keep the dirt on me. All right, let's get back to work. Throw them in an anvil and clear the name. It'll revert to default and be stackable again. Is that real? Let's have a little look at this. This right here? Let's see. Go like this. Let's go like that. Hey. What if I just call it something else? Free impulse suck. I'm going to do that. I don't think I should do that. All right, we'll leave it like this. That was a, that was a good shout. Didn't even think about that. Very smart. Uh, do I want to keep this on me? Yes, because I got problems. Okay, here we go. Actually, since I'm here, I might as well grab some more rockets. Do I have any in here just to grab them? Yeah, I'll just leave this for now. Okay, there we go. Whee! 
<laughs> Man, dislocated my shoulder. And I'm lost. Dude, I was super lost. All right. Now let's keep going. So we go blop and blop. There we go. Now, you guys remember. I feel like I should mix a little mud in here, don't you think? Wait, not mud. Uh, muddy. Wait, what is, what is happening? This mud here. I don't know if I should or not. Is this going to make it dumb? How much darker is that? I feel like I should mix it up a little bit. Yeah, I want to go back and forth a little bit. We're going to dig some of that up. Let's go over here. It's getting dark again. B-dubs! Oh, no. Okay, it's my time to shine. Assistant Sleep Master. I'm on it. I'm on it. Can, can we get a what's up? That was amazing. Ouch. Oh, I almost died. Woo -hoo 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 -hoo. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead and fix that. I'm a chunky monkey. <laughs> oh, yeah. My shoes are not doing great. Depth Strider and Protection 3 on these things. I really should put mending on them and repair them. <sighs> I don't want to get sidetracked, man. Should I go buy a mending book and put it on? <laughs> I feel like I should. I'm going to buy a mending book really quick. We're going to do it really quick. And just let me, because I want my kicks. And I'm breaking too. I should do it. Let's get on breaking three. What do I have on them right now? Depth Strider. Yeah, let's get on breaking three and mending. Put it on them. Let's get some XP. Get them repaired. Jeez. <laughs> Look at that. Go treat yourself. What's funny is what you're seeing here is reflective of how I live my actual life. Right? I want my family to have, like, the best of the best. I want my girls only wearing Lulu. And uh, my, my wife and my daughter only wearing Lulu. I want my son to have the best of everything. <laughs> but then my... My wife's like, you have holes in your shoes. It's okay. Uh, I already, I'm lost. Oh, here we go. What am I, I don't need mud. I want to go into here. How's our cats doing? I only named one cat, I think. Cora Penelope. Look at you. It's a good kitty. It's a good kitty. Now, listen, you've been licking that spot of your paw for some time now. You got a hot spot. Um, that, we're going to, it's vet time. We got to go to the vet. I don't look at me like that. Okay, let's go. Let's do something. Oh, mending. Unbreaking. Gimme. We get it. And uh, mending. Gimme. Uh, go hop and hop and hop. And then we go hop and then we go hop and we go hop and we go hop and hop. That's that's a nice uh, set of that's a nice set of boots there. Now, before we do anything else, let's make sure we pay because it is me. I'm going to forget. What is it? How much? I didn't buy a drink, but that's okay. So six diamonds. That is too cheap. Six diamonds, man. Oh, wait. What am I doing? Okay. Here we go. Oh, feather falling. That would have been good too. Uh, I think those are more expensive, aren't they? Let me see. No, 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 they're not. Let me tell you, man, Cleo did an amazing job on this place. Is there, am I can't read or what? Where's feather falling? Oh, right there. Okay. <laughs> Give me it. Okay. Uh, can I even do this? Huh? Find out. Up. Up. Oh. 
I mean, that's that's pretty special. That's pretty special. Oh, is it alphabetical? This whole time it's in alphabetical order. Okay, let's uh let's pay our debts. Bop 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 and bop and bop and bop. All right, right. I really, I feel like oh, that just seems. Cleo, if you're listening, you can charge a lot more. I'll tell you, I'd be willing to pay. Um, okay, it's time to go home now. We did it. Let's. We got it. We gotta charge these up though. We gotta. We gotta. We gotta get this. Get these kicks healthy. Why, why am I? What is happening? Got turned around. Probably should have done the helmet too, huh? But there's nothing on it. I'm not even. I mean, that'll. I'll just make one later. I'm not too worried about it. This one. The, the boots were already enchanted. The pants I gotta do, man. They got swift sneak. What am I thinking? Those have swift sneak, dude. We're gonna have to put uh, mending on those fellas later. Now my shoes don't have holes in them. Yeah, we got to repair them right now. So we're going to use the um, the special maintenance hatch on our XP farm that we made. And uh, we're going to we're going to use it just to get these get these all settled. See that nice soft landing because we can't risk it. You know what I'm talking about. Oh. Oh, good. That easy. Okay. Got duct tape on the shoes. I've got my shoes are now Kleenex boxes. Name that. What is that from? If I'm saying my if I'm saying I'm wearing Kleenex boxes for shoes, what show did I just channel? <laughs> Tell me with your face. All right, that's mending. I'm gonna take this off actually. I think if I if I hold this in my hand, would it be this will be first, right? Kevin Malone. That's right, it's Kevin Malone. You guys got it. I did not get a haircut. I definitely need one. I'll tell you that. Um, eat those mic stand. Okay, so if I take these boots and I hold them in my offhand, that makes them like kind of top of the hierarchy for uh, XP, right? William Wallace. <laughs> I'm wearing Kleenex boxes for his shoes. I'm going to go peck a fight. Okay, if held in the offhand... And in hand, they will be the first to be mended. Okay, thank you. Okay, so bop. Yes, dude. Fully repaired, man. I mean, come on. That is amazing. I love it. Yeah, baby. Okay, we're good. Okay, moving on. And waste not want none, am I right? Let's have a little a little snack. What you guys doing down there? Alright, here we go. And we're out of here. I am surprised I did not see any indication of an Easter Phasmo quest by the guys. How did him not force them? You know what? Uh, let's be honest about that. Uh, everybody's been so busy when I saw the Easter special. I'm like, we're blowing it. There's an Easter special right now. And, and we've just been, oh, we've wanted to so bad. But like I said, yesterday was another 12 hour day, 20 minute break in between. Like, like the time is very limited for everybody. In fact, you guys don't mind. Okay, up. Oh. Sorry. All right. I, I worked a lot this morning to get as caught up as possible so I could do a stream. And I was just checking, make sure there was nothing needing my attention right now. And it's kind of nice coming back from sabbatical because, you know, it takes a while to really get your plate loaded back up. It was just two days ago I said to people who, who manage intake, I'm like, guys, let's go. Give me some projects. And so I was like, I, I'm good. I'm, I'm good to go. I took care of all my stuff before sabbatical. Now I'm back, gave me some projects. And so they did. Now I'm like, why did I say that? <clears throat> all right. All right. We got our boots fixed. So that's neat. Pretty nice. Actually. Look at those boots. How have I not named these? 
Call them skizzy kickies. All right, go back this way. All right, so we're back here now. Bop. And I think right about here, let's, it's time to start uh, mixing this up a little bit. Let's do the, the mud here. Grab the mud. And guys, it's not going to be a problem when I put water on top of mud, right? What's my job? All I can say is I work in on a, at a very large tech company. Let's say that. Uh, okay, so good. So I'm good. I can put water. Wait. I can't put water on mud. Are you being for real? What's going to happen when I do that? Professional handsome man. I wish. What happens if I put mud down? Didn't do anything. Okay, maybe I... He's a super spy. Maybe I missed something. I'm gonna have to entertain. I, I, or maybe you guys were referring to something else. Okay, nobody's sleeping. It's up to the assistant sleep master again. A little gentle. A little bit more gentle. Oh, and I still got hurt. I'm confident you're a spy or making spy tech. I got to tell you, I appreciate that. I wish I was that cool. But maybe I am. See, that's what you would say. If you don't want people to catch on to the fact that you're a spy, you would tell them that you're a spy. Hide in plain sight. All right, let's go. Let's keep going here. So we have a little bit of dirt there or mud there. What's, what's the best way to dig this? Oh, my gosh. Hey, that's the way to go then. Nice feel for it here. Man, it always ends up doing so many. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying, Vern? You know what I mean, Vern? Kyle Winter with the 500 biddies. Yo, long time no see, brother. How's it been? Thank you, Kyle. It's been okay. Just busy, busy. Busy, busy. No question. Bandy BC with the 100 biddies. Skiz, you can definitely put water on mud, muddy roots, and even the regular roots if you place it against the side of the tunnel. That is very smart. I didn't even think about that. I didn't even think about it. That's smart. Thank you, Bandy. Tig with the 100 biddies says Choo Choo. Thank you, Tig. Oh. Yes, doodle with 100 biddies, you guys. You guys. Got me thinking. Maybe I want to do some roots. If it has the capacity to be kind of cool. Let me cross that bridge. What do you got? We got derps with 100 biddies. Still looking for the joke of the day, but hype train. I When I saw your name, I'm like, how's there not been a joke of the day? Okay. This is your purpose. One of your many purposes. Optum with 100 bits, skin paws, <laughs> skin paws with 100 bitties. <laughs> you guys are awesome. Thank you. How do we feel about the roof of this thing being just the roots? I think that's okay. Yeah, I think that's okay. I kind of want to break it up a little bit. I don't know if this should always be roots like this. Right? Maybe we should mix it up a little bit. Yeah, mix up the roof too, right? The sides I'm leaving dark. I'm not sure if that's smart or not. I don't know. Lady DW, the 200 biddies. Just over giving up it. Lady DW, thank you. Actually, as long as I, right? Do one of those guys right there. Here we care. We're going to light this thing up on top. In fact, where's my liking? Found it. Junks of the bits. Would you like to hear a dirty joke? The pig fell in the mud. You know, I you want to so here's a here's a nice corny joke for you. You guys ready for this? When I was a kid, my buddy told me this joke, and I don't know. I mean, I was it was funny because I was a kid, but here I am, an old man, still so funny to me. 
And it's, I think it's because of the way he said it. Okay. You guys ready for this? He said, this is all, this is what he said to me. He goes, you want to hear a dirty joke? And I said, yeah. And he goes, I was very young. He goes, a guy fell in the mud. And I was like, okay. And he goes, you want to hear a clean joke? He took a bath with bubbles. You want to hear a dirty joke? Bubbles was the next door neighbor. And for some reason, it was that deadpan delivery that just caught me. I started laughing so hard. <sighs> because I'm a giant child. Okay. I have to turn here. And I think what I'm going to do is we're going to... We can't put lichen in there. Huh. I can't put... Hmm. This could be interesting. I mean, it's just going to be water, so I'm not worried about that. What I could do is this. No, I can't. Um, I know what I can do, dude. Check this out. Are you watching? Why not? How many times am I going to do that? Um, if I do this, I can leave that there. Go bop. Oh my gosh, guys. I'm out of concrete powder already. I'm very upset with myself. You can put lichen on roots, but the thing is, if there's water, the water is gonna mess it all up. Don't you think? Not to mention, yeah, man. There we go. There we go. Going back. This is gonna be hard to do water if I'm gonna do it last minute like this. You know what I mean? Scare the crow with the, with the uh, tier one sub seven months. It says thanks to the going gray for my sub. Going gray. I haven't heard that name in a while. Uh, okay. Now it's time to eat. There's the chunky. See, Des Doodle cares about my tum tum. So lichen can't be waterlogged. That's great. But when I'm in a one wide channel of water, there's nowhere to put the lichen though, right? Uh, let's see. Let's let's play with this. Like, if I take this guy, can I put this right there? Yeah, I can put that there. And it didn't kill that spot, so I can just put it in the water? Shut up. I really thought it was going to take a full block. All right, let's check this out. Got to be careful that we don't jack this up, because if we... You know what I mean? You gotta be careful here, because if I like, if the water spills out onto the the carpet, oh my gosh, mom is gonna be so mad. All right, let's go. Pop, pop. How many blocks is this? Because if it's too much, it's gonna. Let me just put a regular thing here for now. That's kind of nice right there. That's that's good. Okay, here we go. Let's put some water here, just to do it. Comes this way. Now I should be able to take this. And, oh, no, see, it kills it. See, see, it kills it. I mean, I, could, I guess I could put it. I would kill the water source if I did that. It didn't. It just stops it. Okay, 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 okay. Yeah, okay. Just a straight up block of water, which means we can get rid of this guy. We want to, no, no. Naughty. Okay. Well, we don't even need it here. That's really, that's, that's the moral of the story right there. We don't even need it there. Okay. And we're going to do a water source, or we're going to make, and it's going to be a solid water sources the whole way through. Woo. This is going to be, dang it. I got to make concrete people. I got to make more concrete. All right. All right. Gotta go make more. I put all I put it all away, didn't I? I put the I put the black dye away. Ah. Give me that. Give me that. Who are you? 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 Boy, I really did all that sand, did I? Man, alive. I did all that sand. That's no good. 
gonna have to go collect some more sand, man. People, I'm gonna have to collect some more sand. Uh, <laughs> you guys are like, why don't you cry about it? Okay, we're gonna go for a little trip. I can sell wood for sand. We're going for a little trip. Oh, Mr. Sandman. Man me a sand. Bum, 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 bum. Have I sold any mangrove at seven? I have not. I don't think I've sold any mangrove since I moved it. I'm not sure if people know. Yeah, why didn't I bring a shulker? I'm just going to get as much sand as I can in an organized fashion. And there you go. Japanese Cherry Frog says, uh, Skiz. I've been having a rough time recently, so watched you and the other hermits has really helped. Thank you for being so amazing. I haven't started on your painting yet, but once I am done with Jimmy's, I'm starting on yours. That's cool. Jimmy, Jim, 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 Jimbo. All right, ready, guys, for awesomeness? Here's what we're going to do. Make sure we're getting all the right stuff. Put everything away. We'll just see spots fill with sand. And you don't, yep. Get rid of that. So now, just these spots will fill with sand. And there you go. And we want it to be somewhat... It's already dark again. I didn't bring a bed. Guys, somebody... And it's... Somebody else is going to have to sleep for once. I didn't bring a bed. I'm going to make this a kind of a general... Like a kind of a gradual organic step down. So it doesn't look too decimated. It's going to keep this... A relatively natural shape of this little mountain here. Is this mending? No! <gasps> Cubby! Thank you, Cubba Dub. Rubba Dub Cub. All right. Look at this on my heart. <laughs> I tell you, when you get sand, it happens quick. It happens quick, man. Oh, that's it. Okay. Gimme, gimme, gimme. And then we fly back. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Yeah, gimme, gimme, gimme. See, it's relatively natural looking. Now, right, let's get out of here. Let's make like a tree. Get out of here. Why not use a flying machine to mine sand for you? Well, because I was... I was fine just getting it manually. Because uh, it, was, it was easy. That was, what, like 45 seconds of my life? That is Back to the Future. I haven't done a lot of name it's today. That's for true. Skiz looks like he sometimes wears shoes without socks. <laughs> what? <laughs> that is a very, very specific uh, presumption. Uh, I, I will tell you I don't. That I don't do. That is too gross for me. I'll wear like... And I'll tell you what else I don't do, and I'm not judging, but I'm judging a little bit. I never wear, like, sandals with socks. I don't know how people do that. I don't know. Oh, makes me crazy thinking about it. Okay, here we go. So now, what am I going to do? Take this guy, throw him out. Um, first things first, I'm the realist. We got to go over here. And we got to do a little bit of the bop. Sometimes you get a bop in life. Okay? Like I said, I don't make the rules. Okay. I really need more gravel already. That's a good amount of black concrete, though. So let's let's get busy here. I go bop, bop, bop. Bop, bop, bop. Oh, my gosh. People! Ugh. It's making me crazy. 
It's making me absolutely crazy. I mean, it's adorable that you guys think that my inventory management is annoying. You should try being me. All right, here we go. You just have to look at it. I have to deal with me. Um, all right, let's get back out of here. And hop. Yeah, baby. Okay, getting all the good stuff. Oh, it's time for the bop song. All right, after we do this, we start building out again. We're going to do the bop song. Buddy Bon, you stop it. What did you do for April Fools and Easter Sunday? I did nothing for April Fools and I did nothing. I worked on Sunday because my wife and my daughter are on the East Coast right now. Look at why did they do this to me? Um, but I did. It wasn't like I worked the whole day. I only worked for honestly, maybe five hours. So I, re I really did take it easy. Uh oh, up oh, there we go. I re yeah, I did release real life. That's right. Yeah, we released the VR version of real life. Yeah. So essentially, that's what I did on that Sunday was finish editing that so I can get that out. Or did I do the day before? You mentioned your daughter got a baseball injury in the last and the latest. Um, she had, um, it was, it's softball and she got, she tore her ACL. So season's over for her. It's very, this is a very dark chapter in our lives right now, man. Uh, I am very confident there will be a podcast about this later. Now that I've, there'll be a podcast about it. I'm sure. Um, it's been rough and she had the surgery six days ago and the recovery has been, they discovered during the, the surgery that her meniscus was also damaged. So my wife is over there just doing great, taking care of her, getting her through the post-op because she can't do anything. It's been rough. Definitely been rough. Would love to hear a podcast about resilience. You know, we, that's what's, yeah, we, I need to listen to our podcast on resilience because we, we did one, right? Or was it, was it resilience or it was a while ago? I'm pretty sure we did one on resilience. Big K of the prime sub. Thanks so much. Loon with the hundred biddies there. Can you have a skiz bit take place in the air somehow? So when Tango summons, he says, oh, you know what? You're way ahead of me. I honestly was thinking about that. Great minds, by the way. I was literally thinking about that yesterday. I got to find a way to work that into the air somehow. So I, I'm thinking about it. But yeah, I'm thinking probably I'm probably going to hot guy somebody. You know what I mean? And do that, you know? <laughs> Who knows? That's a really good idea, though. That's, that's going to be very tough to do and have it be smooth. It's a good idea, though. Prayers for a speedy recovery. Thank you. How old is she roughly? If you don't mind me asking, she is, I mean, I'll give you a grade level. She's, she's, uh, she's in the latter part of college. We'll say that Maddie, give the two subs. Thank you very much, Maddie. But to me, she's all, she'll for, she's my, my little sweet pea always, which is crazy. <laughs> she's like this grown into this extremely capable, independent, very strong woman, but she's my sweet pea. And that's, I'm sticking to it. You know what? To her credit, I cannot believe after all this time, she has not asked me to stop calling her sweepy. <laughs> you think she would have been like, uh, dad, that's enough. But she does. She's never asked me to stop doing it. <laughs> she is amazing. Uh, all right, so now what am I gonna do? Is we're gonna carry up? Oh, look at that guy. You thought you'd get away? I don't think so. Meanwhile, he's like, I don't want to spend all my eternity in this box. Hey, listen, you chose to be a black box, okay? He's like, actually, you made me, and that's why I'm like, shut up. All right, let me go. No mobs, no mobs, no mobs, no mobs. Good. All right, moving on. We're going to do this. I, I feel like it's too dark in here to work anyways. 
And in fact, I can see myself actually doing the water channel prior to the roof because that's just going to be very, very difficult otherwise. Now, here's the other thing, people. Okay, once we do this, we're going to tear it down. Because, not the whole thing, but we're going to tear it down because we're going to start to visualize the other uh, potential for like shooting off in different directions and stuff. Yeah. Ah, there I go again. Come on. Ow. Chloe says, take it from a daughter who lost her dad. Who lost who lost her dad. Never stop calling her that. It means so much. Ah, oh, you were, you were going to make me tear up on stream and I don't want to do that. Well, I, I do appreciate those words, though, because I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> oof. All right. Oh, no. Bop. So now we got to let's fill this in here. Bop, 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 bop. And. OK, so that's a. That's an interesting little turn there. Can we turn in, in water like that? Like, is that, does that, do you guys know, does that destine us to get stuck? What do you think? I want to make sure I'm not creating something impossible. I've never, I'll be honest with you. I never really thought about that. You know what I mean? So let's do this. Let's, let's do a little, you can get through it. And now some people are saying, yeah, stuck. We're going to test it. I'm getting mixed reports here. We're going to test it. All right. So we're going to block that off and I got to get, let's do this really quick. Uh, just start here, do this and let's have it go this way. And I need to get another water source to properly test this. I just want, I got to test this real quick. I want to make sure I'm not cre ouch, ouch. I want to make sure I'm not causing a problem here. Oh, and it's late anyways. I got to sleep anyways. When you're swimming, you're one by one. Okay. All right, drummer dev, you have a good one. I bid you adieu. You it was, are you, you sound like, uh, um, oh boy. Um, Andre from the league. Is that what you're channeling? Andre from the league. I got to know. Oh. Did I win real life? I'm not giving spoilers. <laughs> Film. I just imagine skits flying around, bumming into things. Sounds like Peter Griffin falling down the stairs. <laughs> you know, it's, it's Peter Griffin's got just... I can't, I cannot get enough family guy. I'm going to always be a fan of family guy, dude. Always. And I didn't get water. Okay. Let me see. Now I do want to do this. Can I, can I get this? Hold on. Ready? You ready? Watch this people. Let's try this. You guys ready for greatness? Let me see if I can do this. I've always wondered. Can I do this? Can I get water without touching the water and head back out? I touched the water, didn't I? It was still neat. <laughs> All right, let's go check this out. Okay, now what am I going to do? Is we're going to grab this guy here. Uh, okay. Let me get this water. 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 Let me get this is a chore. Clean it up is going to be kind of a chore too. Uh, I messed up somehow. There we go. It's hard to see, man. Okay, you guys ready? All right, let's go. Eh. I need to swim. Uh, I got a trap door on me. Let's try it here. Man, this is really bugging me. I don't want to do it like this. We're gonna, But we're going to do it. We got to do this. I just want to try to turn this corner. That's all we want to do. Oh, my goodness gracious. All we want to do is turn this corner 
Just to test it, just to make sure we're good to go. Okay. Okay, here we go. Where's the door? There's the door here. Here we go. Okay. <laughs> science. We did the science. Good for us. That was, uh, that was, I guess I should have just assumed as much. All right, we did the science. <laughs> Proud of us. Now I got to pick all this up. I can't put this in here. It's just going to waterlog it. Um, how about, where's my, do I really not have dirt on me? Here we go. Mud's good. Okay, we're going to clean all this up now. Good news. I didn't, uh, I didn't put water back in the bucket. Well, that was smart. Okay, so now we know. Now we have our answer. Okay, moving on. And speaking of which, we're going to make sure, and let's do, it's not the best way to do this, but here we are, nonetheless. Okay. All right, guys. Okay, we get we carry on. My wayward son. Don't be peace when you're done. Just put it out there. Carry on my wayward son. This is like I'm very much enjoying this. Where's all my lichen? <gasps> where's my lichen? People, where's my lichen? Did I really put that away? Okay, I'm very embarrassed that I'm doing a terrible job with that. Oh my gosh. Oh, we haven't bopped yet. Let's do that while I look for my lichen. Good job. Uh, let's go bop and bop and bop. You go bop and bop. Ready? Ooh, way to go. Good job. All right, are you going to bop it up? I can bop if you want it. Let's go. You can bop if you want to. If you leave our friends behind. But if our friends don't bop, and if they don't bop, then there are no friends of mine. Bye. You can bop if you want to. You can leave our friends behind. But if our friends don't bop, and if they don't bop, then there are no friends of mine. So we just go bop, 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 you can bop, 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 You can bop, 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 Wait. My guy. You can bop if you want to. You can leave our friends behind. But if your friends don't bop, and if they don't bop, then there are no friends of mine. You can bop if you want to. You can leave our friends behind. But if your friends don't bop, and if they don't bop, then there are no friends of mine. So we just go bop, 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 bop. You can bop 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 You can bop 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 You can bop if you want to You can leave our friends behind But if your friends don't bop and if they don't bop then there are no friends of mine You can bop if you want to You can leave our friends behind But if your friends don't bop and if they don't bop then there are no friends of mine Alright You can't just get me started I think I I like a little push car dude you know what I mean? <laughs> I actually like that rendition. That was great. Ready? <laughs> and we're done. Don't you like that? That ticket ticket? The 16 notes at the end there? Uh, all right, music back on. We're back at it. I know that is a good beat. Oh, it's, it's amazing to me that it was it was an, a Skyblock evolution that Impulse and I were doing. 
And all I said was, you can bop it up. And he goes, you can bop if you want to. And then he said, you can bop if you want to. You can leave your friends behind. Wait, all he said was, you can bop if you want to. And I said, you can leave your friends behind. But if they, wait, but if your friends don't bop, and if they don't bop, and there are no friends of mine. It was like four seconds of our life. And then Ellie Beatmaker comes along and just makes a masterpiece out of it, dude. <laughs> oh, it was good stuff. Okay, so now we have to hit that. And I went, oh, I was just, ow! I was just so I can make more like it. I did so I can make more like it. I didn't do it. Your stuff is in the chest by the door. What, like there's lichen in here? Oh. I have a question for you guys. Uh, once upon a time, we uh, we did a, uh, a podcast about the, the power of the word why. I'm going to go ahead and use it. I'm going to channel it right now. Why? You guys are so lovely for sticking around and watching me. But why? Why? When I do things like that. Why? Do you waste your time on Uncle Skids. I do appreciate it. Why not? It's right. Ooh, good one. Because I want to. <laughs> I love it. Because it's funny. Good. That's what we're going for. See what you guys don't know. I'm actually brilliant. I'm so brilliant, in fact. Uh, that uh, I don't even... Where's the grass block I just picked up? I'm so confused. It doesn't matter. Uh, that I mess up on purpose. I do it for you. I do it because I care. All right, let's, let's do a little bit more. Let's get some more like in here. I like doing like in like this, dude. Bob, let's do a little bit more like that. All right. And then just go, what's up, what's up, what's up? What's up, what's up, what's up? Dang it. Uh, bop, 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 bop. Bop, bop. Bop, 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 bop. Doesn't really matter. What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? We've been to a motel. Name that. Maybe you should. I know. I love the. I know the snail trail here. All right, uh, pick it all up, and we're good. We're good on liking for now. Okay, and that is so bizarre. It's time to sleep. All right. Okay, back to work. Oh, no, 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 no! No! Stupid jerk! Ah, oh, I had to be a creeper. And I reacted quick too. Man! Gosh darn it. Oh, that's a tick. That is problematic. I did not enjoy that, Mr. Creeper. Dang it, man. Leave for two seconds. It's got to be a creeper. I fly right into him. <laughs> All right. Keep me alive. Be right back. Be back in 90 seconds.
Share stream. All right, we're back. I can't believe that happened. That was such a bummer, dude. Dang it, man. All right, so let's do this. Let's put uh, let's put that lichen right here just for now, just to light this up just a little bit. We'll, we'll fix it. I got to get some dirt. Um, I wonder if I've got some. <gasps> That's embarrassing, dude. I'm better than that. Okay, let's go. Let's go over here. This is my bad. Phoenix with the new tier one sub. You're amazing. Thank you so much. Derp says, uh, just want to point out that your chat is one of the few that doesn't require emote only because <laughs> they just do it naturally. <sighs> one creeper, dude. And back we go. Stupid creeper and it's stupidness. Gosh darn it, man. All right, so let's uh, let's put this back to normal just for now, and then we got to repair the actual. I don't know what it destroyed in the actual path. We're gonna have to take a peek at that in two seconds here. Okay, so here's the finish line. So it did destroy this. Oh, not not a big deal. I think it turned right here, anyways, didn't it? Yeah, I think it turned right here, anyways. I think we're in business. Okay. It didn't oh it did destroy that a little bit what a jerk creeper probably feels like a big man bully what a bully you want to know what i need dude i need a beacon uh you said they're half price just says i'm new what is this pyramid uh i'll tell you so some of you, many of you are aware of what we're doing, but what we're building here, let me back, I'll, I'll, I gotta, I think I'm gonna go get, ugh, I think I'm gonna go get a uh, beacon anyway, so I can give myself a jump boost. Uh, we are building Maslow's Pyramid. And Maslow was a, um, was a philosopher and a psychiatrist, or a psychologist, and um, it's basically about the hierarchy of needs, right? A lot of you have heard this before, so I'll try to get through quick. The hierarchy of needs. It's it's a human thing. And essentially, you cannot work on... There's five levels. One, two, and then there will be three, four, five. And you cannot work on any level if the one underneath it's not taken care of. Even though you do have the tendency to go up and down, uh, you gotta you can't be work on one if the one below it's not taken care of. So, the first level is physiological. It's just the basic stuff. Uh, you need water. You need air. You need sleep. Um... You need food. So that's what this first layer is. Second second layer is going to be security and shelter. So once, you, you, once you're taken care of from a physiological standpoint, then you can start to think about shelter uh, and safety and security and stuff like that. Uh, after that, it's going to be love and belonging. That's when you start seeking family and groups and uh, community, stuff like that. After community, it's going to be esteem, which is more inwardly focused. Uh, it's going to be about actually feeling good about your existence, feeling good about what you have to offer the group that you hold so dear and stuff like that, uh, seeing your value. And then the very top one is what's called self-actualization, which a very, very small uh, chunk of the human population ever even reaches self-actualization. Examples of self-actualization would be like um, uh, Mahatma Gandhi or uh, Bob Ross, stuff like that. People who... Like you look at Bob Ross, he, he was so centered and he was able to do his passion and make a living out of it. And um, typically when you become self-actualized, you start to gravitate towards serving and because the self has been managed, right? So we're working on the physiological layer right now. And what that means is we're, I want to make this a miserable experience. <laughs> Once you get in here, you're going to instantly start drowning, uh, you know, kind of really kind of craving that air, craving food because there's going to be designs in here to get you hurt so you need food and just your trek to the top is going to be a brutal one it's gonna be very hard to get there but once you get there 
uh, then ideally you don't need to come back down, right? So you can work. I don't, and I don't know what I'm gonna do for security. That's something I'll, I'll cross that bridge. Right now we're just focusing on this one. <clears throat> Look at this. Barista says, I will feel the top pyramid when I graduate and become a teacher. It's interesting, right? We could really, we could really unpack that. I hope you do. And you might, you know what I mean? But, but if you, so the bottom line is if you're trying to become a teacher to become um, independent and all that, then you're really, you're on the security layer. Um, if you want to get into uh, like a, a good, strong teaching community, be part of a teaching community, that's the layer uh, uh, above it. Um, but if you're talking about moving into esteem and stuff like that and moving up even to self-actualization, then if you ended up being somebody who was like, you become a teacher and teaching becomes your id, it becomes your everything. And now you're actually writing books and you're going to seminars and you're, you are seeking opportunities to grow younger teachers and it brings you overwhelming fulfillment, rock and roll. Now you're starting to lean towards self-actualization. Yeah. And I'm not a specialist in this by any stretch. I've just, I've just always found it to be a very fascinating subject. Okay. So let's go. I think. No, we don't need to do these walls like this. That was dumb of me. I don't, I didn't need to do this wall. Hold on. Let me pick this up. Yeah, let's do that. Oh, more mod chat. Oh, Derps has a short but sweet joke of the day. I walked down the street dressed as a screwdriver. I turned a few heads. <laughs> I like it. I like that a lot. Uh, PLP uh, says, I want you to know I'm playing Phasma with friends right now. And uh, right now with, with the stream in the background and moments before a ghost, a mimic, in case you were curious, hunted, the bop song ended. Ooh, I like that. I like that a lot. Bob says, just remember to light the top. Uh, the top, like the, yeah, the roof up here, right? Yeah. Up here, yeah. We're, we're putting the occasional like in. Oh, I did take these away. That's a good shout, actually. Okay. So I am going to get with Tango. And I'm going to get that uh, mod from him in regards to making it so I can actually see the the black stuff. We're going to do the water later. Okay, we did all this. This is the hole. All right, so now what we want to do, now that we've come all the way over here, we know that this is going to be a nice little safe area. That we're, This is going to be sort of a checkpoint, right? So we'll figure out how to deal with this later. And, and ideally, by this time, you're already hurting. You should be hitting block 60, which is when you start to drown around this area here. So ideally, by the time you got here, you're, you're down like, like four hearts or whatever. Right. So let's, we're going to do, we're going to build this piece by piece. Um, and I'll be honest with you. I want to do this now. I want to do it now. Right. I got to get a beacon guys. I got, I need to get jump boost. This is making me absolutely bonkers and it's already time to sleep. We're going to sleep. Then I'm going to go get some bacon and we're going to, we're going to make a jump. We're going to put jump boost on this because it's going to make putting it together a, a lot easier for us. Ali says, Hey, Skis, I know it's a bit late for answering the question of why we're here watching, but after tearing my ACL meniscus and the MCL, oh my gosh. Uh, the Thursday before this Hermitcraft season started, you and all the other hermits have helped me stay sane and even positive while I deal with the after effects of all that. So thank you all so much for doing what you do. Best of healing wishes to your daughter. Allie, thank you very much for that. That is, that's rough, man. Please be patient with your recovery. That is hard stuff. That is legitimately tough stuff. Impulse did want to meet up, but it's not, it's, we're going to have to wait until tomorrow. Ride glue stick, man. I used glue stick to get back and forth between this like so many times and I miss glue stick. Amazing. I feel an actual attachment to it. All right, where you guys know everything. Where's the where's the beacon shop? Let me see if I can just look around and make sense of it. I think if I was looking for snow, I'd be pretty obvious where that is. Up, oh, I'm back already, actually. So you can do today if you're if you're on for a bit longer. Okay, we can do that, dude. Just testing now. Okay, 
we can wrap up my stream with that. I'll probably be wrapping and not too terribly long. Um, you want to do it after stream, bro? Or you want to do it during? See that? If I was looking for snow, I'd be like, that's where the snow is right there. This right here. No, right. Tall tower. What are you talking about right there. Oh, oh, maybe the, maybe, maybe the shop that says beacons on it. M massive. We can do it during. All right, we'll do it during, homie. You let me know when you're ready. Okay, let's go get it. I got to get... This is a great shop, dude. Dude, see what I mean, dude? This is great. And it, it, it represents a beacon. Like, yeah, we'll do it live. I'll write it and we'll do it live. Hands up if you know what I'm talking about. Did you guys catch that uh, podcast where we re, where Impulse and I redid the We'll Do It Live We'll Do It Live by Bill O'Reilly? Where is this stuff? <laughs> what is happening? It's a beautiful shop. Where? How do I shop at it? It's like I go to the mall and I'm like, "Where's the door?" Oh, okay. Wait, what? Oh, okay, this is really beautiful. What is happening? Where where do you actually go shopping? Like <laughs> I'm feeling really brilliant right now. Where do I actually shop? The blue boxes, the sh blue shulker. I don't where are the blue shulker boxes? <laughs> what is happening right now? This is not, I will say this is where it starts to get a little embarrassing. I was at the easiest things in the world is what's throwing me up. Okay, let's go back up again. Let me see what I'm dealing with here. I don't see any blue boxes. Oh, right there. Those? Oh my goodness gracious. They didn't make that too easy. Okay, that's cool. Uh, What's the price? Two diamond blocks each. Okay, okay. Okay, I think that's a fair price, dude. Was there? Here we go. This is in a weird spot. Okay, pop up. I think that is... I tell you, I think this is very reasonable. Very reasonable price, man. Oh, and half price, huh? Man, it's 50% off. Let's go. Should I buy two of them? I feel bad doing that. I buy two. I'm gonna buy two. I buy two. I'm gonna buy two. He said half price. I'm buying two. I bought two. <laughs> uh, I know I should have left a little tip in there, uh, but then I didn't. Oh. Uh oh. I don't have enough rockets to get home. I don't have rockets to get home. Who's that? Somebody said they don't have enough rockets to get home. <sighs> yeah, I have. I have two rockets. I need like four. I left my. I, I already bought a. I bought a shoulder from you. I left it at home like an idiot. Skiz, <laughs> I hope that you uh, like to live dangerously because I'm gonna give you some rockets, but they're eclipse rockets. So. Uh, oh, so I'm gonna blow up in the air. Best of luck. I think you can make it. Just take it slow, and uh, heal when you need to. I believe. Okay. Okay. I'm excited. Good luck. Thanks, Good man. Luck. Okay. First, I'm gonna take off. Which is the regular rockets first. Okay, just the regular rockets first. Where's the thing? <laughs> I know he's gonna want to watch this, isn't he? Hold on. Wait. Uh, there we go. Okay, ready? It's time. Here we go. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> I gotta take a break. Hold on. I gotta heal up. This is how you travel, man. Eclipse firework rocket. Let's get, okay, ready? Now let's watch it. Let's uh, fly it in style. That's right. Woo! <laughs> these rockets are cool, man. I'm saving these. I'm going to get regular rockets. I'm saving these for an occasion. These are nice. These are take him a lot of work. He just gave them to me like a nice fella. Woo! Okay. 
I'm gonna put him in here. Yeah, you heard me. Uh, where's the? Hey, buddy. What's up? <laughs> this is pop up. <laughs> How are you? I saw you fly by, and uh, I I was uh, I'm done with the redstone of the XP bank. Are ya? And I was about to explain, you know, to the viewers and stuff, like, how it worked. And then I realized I was probably going to also have to explain to you how it worked. We do this in one shot. So maybe we could kill two birds with one stone, and I'll come show you, and you can take a peek at the redstone. I got to say, it's tight. Is it? <laughs> it was a tight squeeze, so it's going to be a little rough to see it and explain it. But I, I think we should try it. I think we should go over... And I want to show you uh, exactly what's going on with this XP bank. And hopefully it's working. I have not tested it. So uh, we'll, we'll we'll do it live, yeah? We'll do it live. Let's go check it out, <laughs> we'll man. Do it, we'll do it live. I love it. All right. How's the stream been going? Great, as always. Just cannot believe the back, amazing uh, people that stick around these streams are amazing. I got back a little earlier than I thought. Um, I had to go, had to go get a tattoo with my, my wife. Okay, let me clarify. My wife got a tattoo and I went with her. <laughs> oh, okay, I was like, what? You... Wow. Okay, very good. Yeah. See, I'm jonesing for my next one. And it was one. so, it was super fast. Like, I've, I've, it was just text. So, yeah, it was quick. Yeah, when they're no just text, it it's fast. good. But when it's like, you've seen mine and these, the, this one took two hours and it's because of all the shading and the flare and the, oh my God. Mm -hmm. Especially yeah, the shading. Near, and this, like, the dark part, that. that was a, the gun. The, the tattoo gun was five needles and it was like, it was like that, that was two hours, but it was awesome. Yeah. I, this guy got it done in like 15 minutes, maybe. That's so awesome. <laughs> yeah. It was crazy. All right, let's do this. Oh yes. Okay. So I had to change some things around in the front, but I don't think it's super noticeable. I'm not completely happy yet. Cause there's still little gaps, but um, this should work now you see the lights aren't on yet because it hasn't been running long enough but let's let's go inside this is gonna this is so yeah, impressive. This is gonna blow your mind <laughs> you know it's it's pretty crazy how like one little you know requirement like i want the light to come on when yeah. it reaches a certain level yeah like made this thing absolutely <laughs> ridiculous <laughs> you go up or down okay so, you went up okay yeah come on in come on in um so it's, it's got two different sections of it really i'll go up there with you yeah this is incredible super tight. dude this top part is mainly just to distribute the items so we have two banks right and as things come in we want to kind of get them to separate now i know there's enough cactus to come in that i didn't worry about it too much i was just going to like let it overflow but the kelp comes in a little bit slower so what i did there was basically i load the kelp into this chest mine cart right here and then when it gets enough in it, it will go around and basically drop an item in each bank on its way, like there and then back. Oh, so, so one cart is feeding it both. Distributed. Gotcha. Okay. Yeah, yeah. This one cart will like distribute items evenly to both. Um, so that's how that's going on. Now, if we go down further, that's where things get a little crazy. Come all the way down. I feel like I'm gonna break something. Yeah, just be careful. Maybe myself. Okay. Jeez. Yeah, be careful. Okay. Okay. So here's the thing. What we need to do is we need to understand when the minecart is full, right? So you see how we have like this chest minecart up here? Yeah. As soon as it's full of items, that's pretty much meaning that it's enough for close to 30 levels of, of XP. It's, it's not quite perfect, but it's close. And so what I did was I made it so that this will get ejected basically once it completely fills up with the green dye that's smelting and coming out of the furnaces. Okay. And then that's what turns the light on. Okay. But here's the thing. We just filled a minecart with green dye and we got to do something with that. So, if you would, I'm going to I'm going to fill it manually just so that you can see it. Uh let's see. Where's a good viewing area for this? Come on, come on down. Come on down here. Okay, maybe. okay, okay. And it may be here. Let me let me remove these. Let me get those out of the way. Just just watch this area watch this area okay good. watching yeah okay all right let me get myself situated so i can go load this up oh my gosh I, this is this there's is like crazy pieces of this machine i would have never thought i i'm just like I, my brain's like what is happening there's okay here this we go. makes no sense yeah okay all right so i'm gonna load this card up here's what happens when it gets enough smelted that we're at close to 30 levels of xp it has to turn a light on and then it needs to empty itself you ready yeah here we go <laughs> oh 
What? Did you see that? I yeah, I saw it come in and like a organized dump truck, <laughs> like dump its stuff into yep. the cactus and then go to the right. Exactly, exactly. And so now this mine cart <laughs> with the chest in it is empty. It completely emptied itself and it turned the light on above, I think. We're going to have to go check. If it didn't work, then I messed something up. And so basically now that's that means the system's good. It's it's ready for somebody to come pull XP. It, had it actually come through the the furnace, you know, on its own, not be with me filling it. But dude, um, what? Yes. Yeah, so that's it. And then once they once they um, pull their XP, they gotta just click a little thing, and then that resets the system and tells it that it's ready to go for another round. So Should now we go once up top it and see if it worked. Yeah, yeah. But once it does that, is it still collecting XP? Even though yep. the lights on, yeah. Oh my god, yeah, absolutely. That's awesome. So right now it's gonna it's gonna keep filling up, and if it fills up all the way again, it'll empty itself again. Um, so literally, if if you like, if we let this sit and don't pull XP for like a month, you could get like over a hundred levels um, in theory. So it's yeah, that was the problem with one of the other systems I designed was it just shut itself off and it and then wasted the rest, and I didn't want to waste it. No, so, yeah, this yeah. is great. So let's go up top. Oh, that was that was a lot of redstones. Like, dude, thinking. I am very I had to do to like manage that. Very impressed. Thank you. Thank you. Got, well, uh, gonna... hold off, hold off on that. Okay, good. The lights on. The lights on. Look now, at you that. Won't get 30, you won't get thirty levels, but here's how it works. You come up here, you step on this pressure plate, and what that does is it holds an item in the furnace. So that's what you need to do. You need to be able to pull an item out of the furnace. So go ahead and step up to that pressure plate. There. Okay, we go. Let me see. And step on it. okay. All right. Yeah. yeah. If you got anything you want to repair, hold it in your hand. It's not going to be 30 levels. There yeah. Because we just, yeah. Because you just said, I got it. Yeah. That yeah, is awesome. And now I want to. Yeah. You, you said... got to turn the light off saying so the system knows it's it's not full anymore. So just right click that that note block. We're going to have to leave instructions, I think. There you go. Light <laughs> off. There you go. And the next Shut time, up. And, and so that, also, that also should have sent the chest in for another dump <laughs> so that it's empty again to start over completely right when you did that. Yeah. And then that way, for sure, next time it's going to be another 30 um, levels or so. And then it'll turn back on. So and then you, there you go. If somebody fails to turn the light off, it's still going to keep collecting. It'll still keep collecting. Yeah, it's just then then it's like not guaranteed that when somebody else comes up that they're going to have 30 levels. So hopefully people remember to turn the light off. We'll, we'll put a sign on here. Please, you know, right click yeah. this note block to turn the light <laughs> off after you pull your XP. You know, right now, you know. Yeah, this is our bank for this is for me and you. We, you All know, right. <laughs> until we have our, our proper training course for the rest of the hermits that may may come by here. Stand right here on that block. Okay. All right. Turn in this direction. Okay. All right. Stand in here. I'm bowing. <laughs> That's absolutely sick. I, I, I can't oh, even do gun to my sick. head a thousand years. I could not create what you just create. That that would oh. what you just created. That is that is insane. I I'm looking at stuff like what what is the point of the geo shard? What like just a random up? Oh, this is oh, not going to work yeah, unless I put yeah. a geo shard here. <laughs> you saw how the how the hopper minecart or the chest minecart got like unloaded and then like recycle itself back in the system. Yeah, basically that's how it does it. Like it aligns to partial like in between two blocks, but then there's a rail underneath that's less than a full block away because it's sitting partially on a mud block which is not a full block it, it dro drops down a little bit so then it pulls the cart through but half into one block and half into another and the one half block is a cauldron with lava in it which breaks the cart and when you break those and they have stuff in it it spits out the items we delete those and then it hopper picked up the cart and sent it back yeah, yeah I, that, I, that, I, that part was that part was insane <laughs> Bro, I'm just like you've made a lot of stuff in the past that's been impressive, but this is this is like new. This is new, like new level. This is next level stuff. Thanks, man. Very you know, impressed. My God, and it's all just because you wanted a light to turn. I on. know. The funniest I, part, yeah. like when you said, "Oh, how about an indicator to make sure there's 30 levels?" And I was like. <laughs> He has no idea how much he just made this complicated. <laughs> you know what's funny is I knew that it was gonna it was a it was gonna be a big deal or whatever. But but it, when I when I started to realize that I was like, hold on, I think this is far more complicated than it's. Ah, he'll figure it out. And so and then and not only did you, but like you also proved that it was way more complicated than I could have ever thought ever. Like that is just yeah. absolutely sick. 
like this is that's, this, that's minecraft redstone for you yeah it's, and it's, it's it's usually not as easy as you think i was telling a story yesterday about like when i used to run those big events at work and i would go to the hotels and i would envision what i wanted or whatever and i like you know i shoot from the moon or whatever and when i said i wanted a fresh uh 3d rendered animation on above the escalator as the, everybody's you know descending on the escalator and that animation was to be in theme with whatever that day's topic was people were like that sounds huge i'm like yeah it'll be fine and i found somebody that does 3d <laughs> rendering and i'm like so now that i told him like you have this is my idea but it's no longer my idea this is now your baby so i want you to make this yours and dude he crushed it and i'm just like dude i would never be able to do what he did so i'm very grateful for the people that have the actual talent <laughs> oh man that's impressive man oh yeah now we gotta wait um we just we got to now we got to stand around and wait for that light to turn on so that we can actually test to see if it's got 30 levels. So uh, luckily for me, everybody keeps killing me on this server and I have zero <laughs> XP, like like not even a sliver of XP right now. So I'll be a perfect test candidate when this oh, thing fair. turns on. Yeah. But um, the other thing is we got to make sure that the farms stay loaded. So if the uh, if no one's around, it doesn't load the cactus farm, doesn't load the kelp farm. So these don't actually start to bank up anything until people are online so uh oh okay yeah, counting on you uh counting on you to keep working on that base of yours yes <laughs> yeah man it's taking me long enough i don't think we're gonna have a problem with this being loaded uh listen impulse you should be extremely extremely proud of yourself on this one dude this is very very no, cool no, it was stuff. fun it was a fun project haven't uh haven't dabbled in in redstone at least designing my own kind of problem solving system like this in a while you know it's easy enough to build farms and, and they've all been done before so you kind of know how that works but whenever a new problem is presented and you got to use redstone to solve it that's that's really when you start to flex your your, your brain a little bit and, and uh, it's fun it's fun coming up with stuff i, I had a great time this is it's incredible okay so let me let me do this i what if i ask for one more edition and i already know it's very very trash easy can for the trash no 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 this is oh, okay this is super easy you, you know when you stand on the um uh when you stand on this and it, and it has mm -hmm. a little indicator it has, mm -hmm. you know, like the progress indicator that it's cooking the cactus. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Can, we, can we have that directly related to some sort of light um, measure on the side? So as people are watching. Nope. They... <laughs> <laughs> no, no, that's maybe it. because even you though gave me your requirement, you... <laughs> I did it. It's over. Uh, we're done. As you saw inside, there's no room for any. Dude, more redstone. Also, what I just packed. suggested is like next to impossible. So I was Pretty just much. joking. Yeah, I was joking. Pretty much. Yeah, Bop no, and go, cool, man. Though. Oh, we're not done. Because <laughs> we wanted to play. Yeah. Yeah. When you pull the XP out, basically, I think when we when we turn the light off, yeah. when we hit the note block. Yeah. Let's make it play bop. Yeah. Let's make it play the bop song. Yeah. I love it. I love this idea. I okay. love this idea. I'm I not done. I'm not done. That I will do. <laughs> okay. That I will. I will find a way to make it fit. Okay. I'm so excited. <laughs> Very good. Good I'm gonna, work. I'm going to make it a, a small range, maybe five blocks. Yeah, because, yeah, yeah. Uh, I could imagine Joel not being too happy if Bop is constantly playing. <laughs> you know, it won't even be that constant because if you think about it, these are only going to come on. Actually, how long do you think it takes to, to get full and light up? Have we done? I have no idea. Yeah, I'm curious. I've never, I've never sat here. I don't have the patience for that. Oh, I was thinking like between the two of them, we're looking at a maximum of maybe four times a day. I don't think he'll have a problem with that. Maybe. Yeah. Maybe this is longer. great. I don't know. That's a whole that's a whole chest of uh cactus green that's gotta fill up. That could take a bit. Yeah, I don't know. I, I don't I haven't uh, calculated the speed of furnace smelting and twenty seven stacks. Somebody somebody in the comments will do it for us. Thank you for doing math for us. Appreciate it. Let me Can't tell you read the comment. This is why you all need to have an impulse <laughs> in your life, okay? Having impulse as my buddy is like having my own chat GPT. I just have, I, I, have, I have an idea and I just feed it into the yellow box and then what I want actually spits out something gorgeous I never could have done. But half the time is completely wrong as well. Yeah. <laughs> oh, really good, man. Oh, man. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So, um, yeah, now that we've got this kind of one done, if this works out, we'll we'll test it for a little bit. I say we expand and see if any of the other mountaineers, magical mountain folks, whatever they're called, uh, we are called, wants more of these systems. You know, we could we pro we built big enough farms. We could probably 
install one for everybody if we so if, we, if they want. I think it. that's awesome, and I was actually thinking this will be a good way for us to gauge as to whether or not that there's any sort of value in that. Yeah. So like my point yeah. being this, if this becomes something that's so coveted, people are like, it's never, it's always empty. That's when we're like, okay, we got to make more. You know what I mean? Yes. Yeah. Yes, exactly. Very I good. I know Green will be here once a day. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Just Because that's next how week. often he asks me. <laughs> oh, it's uh, functional. Uh, we did it. We did it. And, and yeah, if there's more banks to be built, we might have to build up the kelp farm a little bit more or something, but uh, that's not a problem. Dude. Yeah. We'll, we'll roll up our sleeves when, when time comes. We need to have like a ribbon cut into this for this thing or something. <laughs> I know, right? All right. Once I get the Bob song installed, maybe we will. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> oh, I love it. All right, man. man. Well, this is finally done. I'm, I'm happy. This has been uh, on the back burner for a while, so I'm glad we could we could finish this up finally. Dude, high five. GG. That is so sick. <laughs> Good job, man. Later, buddy. Later. That was insane. I mean, that's absolutely insane, isn't it? I, like it's it's so like <sighs> do people that smart get headaches and stuff by the way i always knew that he was a smart even before he did <laughs> so you know my credit that is crazy that is absolute uh oh what if there's a creeper over here creeper 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 i think so all right so now what am i gonna do is it's time to start um yeah, yeah, yeah. We can we can do this whole thing like so. And then once we oh no no I'm an idiot. I got I got to do the water first. I got to do the water first. We got to do the water first, people. What did I just say? Water first. Okay, we got to go get water. That's for true. Okay, let's get back in there. I just got a beacon, you know. Remember when I got a beacon? I haven't done anything with it. Mogs, I got it. There was a uh, a raid came in from Mog Swamp. 152 Mogaroonies. That's your new nickname, Moggers. Maybe you're Moggers. Uh, thank you very much for that raid, Mog Swamp. Come on in, everybody. Notorious Gaming, eight months. In Seth, with the three months. Um, Iron Cupcake with 200 biddies. Thank you so much. So check it out. Ooh, and Cable Gooble with the Raider. With the Raid coming in. <laughs> Cable Gooble. What am I channeling when I say Cable Gooble? Look at Jazz says, My grandfather had reached self-actualization and was someone that gave so much to the community. Uh, it is almost one year since he passed and reading about Maslow's Pyramid has been really interesting and oddly comforting and coming to terms with his passing. As for why I'm watching you, to be honest, you usually stream at a really good time in my time zone. <laughs> uh, but since I've come to enjoy either hanging out or having your stream or videos on in the background to help with creativity and motivation. I love it. I love that. <laughs> why do I watch you? Convenience. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Uh, well, that's, that is cool that your, your grandpa was like that. It's a big deal, man. And the fact that that brings, oh my gosh, I didn't put it down. Any sort of healing or comforting is very, very good. Somebody who is self-actualized has done what I think God wanted us to do. Find you all the way until you can serve. Okay, so here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to come back here. We'll place one bucket. And then we'll go. This is going to be tough, man. Hold on, let me dig this out. Right, let's dig all this out all the way. Okay. So I'm very grateful that I have um the depth strider. That's gonna make this a lot easier. Let me go get another bucket. Ah. Skiz read chat challenge. What I miss now. 
<laughs> you know, impulse and I actually talked about that in one of our podcasts. How I'm like, I don't know how you read everything in chat while you're streaming. And he did this thing with his eyes where he looked forward and like did this or something. I'm like, what? I couldn't believe what I was looking at. It was crazy. Maybe I stole the bacon. I paid. Oh, wait. No, 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 no. I half stole the, the bacon. No, I didn't. Oh, were they joking about half price? Were they joking? I will go fix that right now. Were they really joking? Oh, I am such an idiot. Okay, I'm going to go fix it right now. Right now. Impulse, you go to have dinner and shut up. I thought maybe they were in on it together. Hold on, I'm going to go fix it. That's my bad. I'm going to go fix it right now. <laughs> oh, God. P Dubs. Don't you know, gullible I am. That was very irresponsible of you. <laughs> I'm really glad he didn't say free because I was dumb enough to be like, I'm taking all these. No, if he said free, I would have known it. Okay, let's <laughs> This is really funny. Uh, is there an inner chest up here? There is, okay. We're gonna fix this problem right now. Uh, okay, give me two more. And I think it was this one over here, right? I feel like it was this one. No. <laughs> dude, full on. That was such a tango moment, dude. Gosh darn it. But it was such an or all the other ones have been manufactured. That this one's too organic, dude. <laughs> well, there it is. Pop pop. There we go. Never happened. <laughs> oh, this is class. <laughs> I can't stop laughing. I can't stop laughing. You guys, I like you. <laughs> I am concerned. like straight up. I'm like always hugging the corner here, and you guys like so the center's glass, bro. <laughs> I'm over here on the edge, just like reaching. Uh, uh. <laughs> uh okay. Yes, I'm very proud of myself. <laughs> hey, listen, you got to just enjoy the silver lining, okay? At least there's not over 2,200 people watching me make a complete butt out of myself. Gosh darn it. <laughs> Skin thought the center was lava. That's like tiptoeing. Ooh. You want to know what that reminds me of, dude? Here's what it reminds me of, okay? Story time. Dime gifting a sub over to Jazz. Thank you so much. And then uh, Psyduck. BB Psyduck. I almost said something there, didn't I? Uh, with 100 biddies, thank you so much. Story time. You guys want a story? Because I'm going to tell you right now. This is what that whole... Thing reminds me of when I was in fourth grade my very good buddy um, his name is Cameron one of my best friends in the world still to this day we still talk him and I started hanging out a lot he was in fifth grade I was in fourth grade and we just became really oh dynamite what did I say oh the din dynamite thank you for gifting over the chest <laughs> Uh, when we were, okay, so we are we've been buddies a long time. So I'm in fourth grade, he's in fifth grade, and we would play in his backyard a lot. Like, we'd throw the football around, and we just, just did all sorts of stuff back there. Well, his backyard was probably like, if I had to give it dimensions, I would say it was probably about 25 feet wide and about 35 feet long, right? Well, at the end of it, there was a fence. And actually, you know what? His no, I'm, that was his backyard was was like about three times the size I just gave you. But anyways, at the back of it, there was a fence, and that was and behind that was another whole lot. 
And uh, we would play ball and kick the soccer ball, throw the football around. And if a ball went over the fence, that was somebody else's property. We had to go get it. And I would go, I'd be like, okay, I'll get it this time. And I would go over and I was, you know, you're trespassing, man. And I would jump the fence and I would sprint towards the ball like mad and then scoop up the ball and sprint back and yeah. pop back over, pop back over the fence as quick as I can. Petros with a piece of pie. Thank you so much. It says, Skiz, you, sir, have made me laugh harder than I've laughed in weeks. <laughs> Love your face, Skiz. I'm very happy to have Skiz dreams to keep me going through the week. Thank you, Petros. <laughs> anyway, so I would sprint, pick up the ball and sprint back. Then you know, it was my turn to go get it. And then I'm like, okay, we keep playing. And we went over again. Sometimes he would be like, I guess I'll go get it this time. And then he would go. But he was always so just cool as a cucumber, man. Just cool as a cucumber. And I'm like, isn't he worried about getting caught? He'd walk to the ball, pick it up, walk back. So anyways, that was it. Anytime I went, I did not want to be busted for trespassing. I would sprint. He would not. Okay. Let's fast forward a couple years. And, uh. I'm run and one day he's finally like, why do you always do that? Why do you always sprint to get the ball? I'm like, cause I don't want to get caught. And he's like caught doing what? I'm like caught getting our ball. It's not, you know, it's, it's not, it's trespassing. And he's all bro. That's our lot too. <laughs> I had no idea. I had no idea. Like, why didn't you bring that up sooner, man? <laughs> That's a good story. All right. Uh, I never put the bacon on. Oh, I do need some iron. Let me let me get a piece of iron real quick. We're going to do this thing. I have no idea where iron is, by the way. I, I don't know where I have any iron. Like, not even a single piece. Uh... Skiz, <laughs> you're a special guy. You know what? You you had, you could have even put little in there. You're a special little guy, aren't you? And that would have been probably pretty fitting. Guys, what'd you guys do with all my iron? I know. I, I, oh, all I need is one. All right, we're going to go put... Uh, you know what I mean? We're going to go do the thing. With the stuff. We're going we're gonna to do the beacon. That means I got to go in here. Uh, all right. Okay, buddy. I'm going to feed you now. Okay. I'm going to put this little fella on you. Is there a creeper on me? Man. Okay. Here we go, buddy. There you go. Oh, wait a minute. No, no, no. Poopy. I got to cut a hole in that fella. Hold on. That's my bad. Well, I can at least put this down. Oh my gosh, there's glass here. That's twice I've been fooled by glass in a very short amount of time. Okay, here we go. So that, I'm surprised that even lit up. I'm, I'm surprised that, I didn't know it lights up when you don't put anything on it. Okay, well in any case. All right, we gotta get up there and we gotta carve a hole in the ceiling. Oh, I didn't did, did all that without charging it. Can I even charge it when it's not actually on? I, can I? I don't even know. Uh, let's do this, people. Give me my thing. Can I land on top of that? That is a very tall order. I don't know if that's something I'm going to be able to pull off. In fact, I'm not even going to try. We're going to go over here, and the center is where? I feel like the center is... Oh, it's that torch right there. Let's go. That's what you get for being organized. What torch? This torch here? Yeah, baby. All right, so this should be it. Hop. Hop. Ah! Blinded me, man. Uh, all right. Okay. That's kind of dark, isn't it? Probably put a different color on the top here, at least. Oh, good for me. All right. Black beacon light. Oh, I didn't. I didn't. I didn't charge it. I thought I was going to be all cool. Now it's time to charge it. 
Okay, guys. All right, so now we're going to put this fella in there, and I want I want the jumpy boosty boost. I forget how to how to do this. Like that. Right? That will that make it that's good. Give me, give me, give me. Oh, yes. Yeah, baby. Oh, that's good stuff. Hey, hey. Okay, you know what? I'll allow it cuz you're not a creeper. I'll allow it. I mean, not gonna lot forever. I am gonna probably kill you if that's cool. Hey, buddy. Hey, hey. When I jump this high, it's an uber crit. All right. Could have been worse, man. That could have been a creepy deep. Okay, so now it's time to watch this. Oh, I can't get up there. Yes, I can. This is my high levels of awesomeness. Okay, ready guys? Man, this is tough. I cannot see. Woo! It's so dark. Fun. Here we go. This is a job, dude. This is a pretty big, this is a pretty big undertaking here. But I'm so pumped at how cool this is. Dude, I am like so focused. Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh, we got to break it. Oh, beep, pop, beep, pop, boop, pop, beep, beep, boop, pop. Boobie, bop, beep, pop, pop, boobie, bop. I know the lyrics to this song, if you're wondering. Boobie, bop. Guys, uh, hands up if you are channeling the uh, SpongeBob episode where, Mr. where they think Mr. Krabs is a... Uh, a, a robot, All right? Guess what I'm talking. And he's and he's doing beep boop bop into the phone with the radio stations. Anybody know what I'm talking about? Hands up if you read chat. Bop. You guys know what I'm talking about? <laughs> Channeling, get it. No! Dummy! Man! Okay. That's my bad. Uh, I should have seen that coming a mile away. Let's put that guy right there. I meant to do that, too. I meant to, uh... Hold on. Let me pick up this guy. Man? Oh no. I'm gonna need that trap door, you know. <laughs> Hold on. I gotta get the rest of this. I gotta put these back down. Gosh darn it. Gosh darn it. There we go. Bop, bop, bop. I'll tell you what, it is going to be a long night. I am going to finish this episode and I'm going to get it out tomorrow. And I'm also going to edit the entire uh, Smajor podcast. Doing all that tonight, folks. And you want to know what? I love it. Look at this. We're almost there. This is all be. I'm sitting there all happy that that skelly wasn't a creeper and I basically became a creeper myself. It's a major podcast. That's right. Don't overwork yourself. Yeah, I know. I got to I need to take it easy sometimes. Loon, we love all the content is makes. Thank you. You guys are amazing, man. 
I didn't even say all that for like attention, but I but I'll take it. Uh, hold on. Um, let me do this. Let me go like this. Let me go like this. All right. Okay. 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 Now, what am I gonna do? Is it's time to do the roof, which we're all very familiar with. And we're gonna do. We were going back and forth between. I think we weren't doing just the roots, were we? I gotta light up the top, folks. I got. I have to put more lichen. Uh, above here because it's getting getting a little risky like in there I guess I did do I'm gonna do all I guess I did do all all black ceiling then huh yeah, yeah okay yeah yeah that makes sense because it was the no we don't need to be that high hold on yeah yeah it was the ground I tweaked I think I'm gonna have to put the black uh, concrete above these roots. I had to guess, but maybe not. Maybe I'll leave it so it's a little bit more lit up. In fact, boy, how, what does that look like with a lichen on top of one of these fellas? Oh, that's nice, dude. Look what it does to the water. Come on, how cool is this? Yeah, I should. You're right, Petrus. I should put some. I was doing that with uh, the the blocks, the light blocks, but it was messing up my ability to see what was a risk. You know. Now we gotta get more roots. Let me put a couple of these. Down. First of all, I'm this this whole thing here, people. Oh, that is just gorgeous, and what it does to the water underneath. Feel I'm feeling good. This is, this is a lot of fun. I know it sounds so insane to get excited about something like this, but I, honest to God, am like doing something right now I never, I thought I would never do. And that's trying to be artistic in a very, very angled way. You know what I mean? Like this is like the fact that I'm lighting up a one wide water channel that's designed to be scary and the light I'm giving it, it leaves much to be desired. It's good, yeah. So I'm not gonna have um, secret air pockets, but but what I am gonna do is have um, uh, checkpoints like this here. This will open up. You can make it here uh, alive. If you start back there, you can make it here alive. You're gonna start getting hurt around there. Just did a bunch of science on this yesterday. Yeah, okay. Oh, you know what I'm gonna do? Oh, that's a great idea. Oh my gosh, check this out, people. I think I'm going to have it so that if you, um, if you, if, you know, cause it's going to be kind of a maze. So I'm going to have it stem out here and in just random places so you can get lost. But at every dead end, I think I'm going to have like a sign that leaves like a daunting message. Like you're at the point of no return, man, or something to that effect. And I'll put it, uh, I'll, I'll plane it glass with the sign behind it and I'm going to light it up. So it'll help light that dead end. And this will be cool. This will be cool, man. Yeah. Yeah. We counted, we counted the blocks. Like that right there is like just about a hundred. Um, okay, I gotta get more roots. Yeah, a little bit more roots here. POP says me holding up my phone, filming you. You're doing amazing, sweetie. <laughs> POP, POP, POP. Uh, where is my rockets? Okay, let's get out of here. And I gotta sleep. Boom with 100 biddies. Bop with 100 biddies. You're amazing. Cyber with 100 biddies. Bop saying, light it up, man. Creeper. Cyril Map with 100 biddies. Friday's podcast title or caption suggestion. Skiz and the Scots. <laughs> you know what? I haven't decided on a caption yet. I always, when I edit it, I get a feel for the video and do it that way. Okay, so now let's get down there. And I didn't get any more roots. Okay. Look at that chicken. You know, this, look at this chickens learning from some parent from a pyramid. Okay, give me that. Give me that. Uh, let's put these in there for now. Oh, Drax is down there howling away. What's going on down there? I'm going to make sure everything's okay. Hold on.
Give me, give me a second, everybody. Be right back. I get paranoid about my dogs. I, it was Drax was doing this weird howling that sounded sad. And I was worried that Kevin fell into the pool because I had to have my pool drained. But no, I went down there. Kevin's just sleeping on the stairs landing, taking a nap. And Drax is howling at him because he wants to play. That's what that was. <laughs> that's, that's exactly what that was. Uh... Uh, okay, we got all oh, we got to do more over here. Okay, good, good. And let's go here and let's go ahead and grab that trap door, which is in my pocket. And uh, not that you need to go back, but I'm going to put it there anyways. Okay. So now let's try it just to get there. Let's try to get here. We got to take some clothes off. Actually, we'll make a clip out of this. Yeah, let's do that. Let's, let's, let's film a clip. I'm going to pause the alerts real quick. Let's see here. Uh, that's not good. I'm gonna actually start recording here. There we go. Okay. Okay, well, this is us just getting started. Uh, what we got going on here is there is there's so much there's a lot more to do, and, and and part of it is I'm gonna be coming off of this stem. You guys saw I was all over the map when I designed what the lighting was going to be. I started with, uh, with the frog lights and it was too bright. Uh, so we dialed it back and we just sort of kind of found the sweet spot, which is why is that there? That's all us sorts of wacky. I got to get rid of that. It's going to make me nuts. So we're going to be branching off of it, coming off the sides and misleading people and stuff like that. Plus there's going to be some signage on the inside and stuff like that. So we are really, we are just getting started, but this is just an idea of what it's going to be like. So let's, and in fact, I'm, I'm curious if I can even make it through this because based on the math right around this area should be where you start to feel uh, pain for the first time. You start to panic. Oh yeah, baby. And then over there is going to be, uh, that's, that's actually where you, you would almost die around here, but you should be able to make it. No, 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 not. you should be. I think I'm going to be at, I think I'll be down five hearts by the time I get here. That's what I think. Right. So this one's not even supposed to be, the hardest one. So later, like to finish it off is going to, you're going to need perfect execution. So that that's for another time. But for now, let's actually try this. You want to stop that. Um, bop, bop, bop. Oop. Um, yeah, we're going to go ahead and stop. And I don't want to risk any of my stuff or whatever. Oh, and I got to take my boots off. We got to make sure we do that. I take these off. That we beefed up since then. That's what I'm talking about. So we're going right in our birthday suit. I, wait, wait, wait. I do deserve to be all the way. We got to go like this. We got to eat. Get all the way saturated. Okay, there you go. That's perfect. Okay, there we go. Birthday suit, not hungry. And we're gonna go this way. Let's uh, don't don't get hurt on the way down. That would be bad. There we go. Okay, it's go time. Oh, there we go. Now it's not super fair because I've been you know I I know it because I just built it. But anybody else, we're gonna be branching off. Oh, like oh the the key is once they get here to be like I don't even know if I'm supposed to go this way because there was all these other options behind them. Right here we go. Okay, can we make it? Okay, so. First things first, we're going to have to see these, this lighting right here. That is a cool look right there. I like that. Okay. So I'm again, what am I getting stuck on? I think it's these mud blocks are a different height or something. Uh Oh, Oh, that's something to think about. Yeah, they're slowing me down a little bit. Oh boy. Oh, I'm stuck. Come on. Ah! Oh! <laughs> 
Okay, I said I'd be down five hearts. Look at that. Crushed it. So down five hearts. And so now by this time, you can see I'm going to start to get some of those hearts back, but then I'm going to get hungry. So the idea is not to give them food right away, but maybe have another channel uh, that that's that's um, it's really going to push the envelope before they get any food. The premise here being that the entire time you're trying to ascend the physiological layer, you really are suffocating the whole time. Uh, you're starving the whole time. You know, th that's the whole premise of it. So uh, that's what it is. I like I like I like where we're at so far. And scene. I almost stopped streaming just now, just so you know. I've got two open. <laughs> Don't even joke, man. If I didn't record that, yes, I was recording. I just, I literally just now hit stop recording. Um, let me go unpause alerts. Uh, who's on? Probably nobody. Uh, yeah, there are some people. Dude, last night I was like the only one on for a while. That was actually kind of cool. Okay, so that gave me what I wanted. Problem is, I don't know how to get out of here. I'm gonna have to kill myself. I can't get out of here. Man, I'm never gonna make it. Let's do it. The key, I think, is to stay high because I was hitting those mud blocks. I might leave it in there like that. That might be a nice little stick. Stickler until they uh until they figure out, you know. Oh my gosh, the only reason I'm getting oh boy. The only reason I'm getting through this is because oh my gosh! No Man. That's okay. My stuff's up here anyways. Alright. <laughs> I'll keep it that one. Okay, uh here we go. So my stuff is here. Alright, so we're gonna end the stream here. Actually, no, no, stick around. I'm gonna do a closing. I'm gonna do a closing. Um, we'll do one more take here. There we go. Uh, let me think. Ba -ba -ba -ba. And as I put my clothes back on here, of which I, where's my hat? Found it. Don't worry about it. I got my hat. I took it and put it on. Now I feel whole again. That's good. And okay, so we're gonna keep working on it. That's what that bottom layer is gonna be. It's gonna continue to evolve. Uh, and continue to invite more challenges and stuff like that. So do me a favor. If you can think of something that it could be cool in there, uh, throw it in the chat. Throw it, throw it in the comment section. I might check that out. And, and I might do it. I might not. I mean, I don't know. You know what I'm saying? It's, just, it's always good uh, to seek inspiration wherever you can find it. But I am getting more and more ideas what we're going to do. One thing I didn't tell you is that when people hit dead ends, there's going to be like a sign there that's like giving them a daunting message that you might be past the point of no return, stuff like that. It'll be behind, be behind a pane of glass. It'll be a lit up sign. Uh, to bring cool lighting. I'm just very excited. A lot of things going on. So uh, uh, so I'm going to be thinking about it. And we're going to continue that next episode. Until next time. You guys know the drill. Be good. Be good to each other. I will see you soon. That's my outro. Oh, I don't know if it committed that to memory though. It didn't. I got to do that again. One more, one more time. I got to do that again. I can do it again. I got to do it one more time. No big deal. All right. Here we go. Uh, let's fly back in. We got to do this whole thing again. Because I... Wait. I don't know what I just got. No, I did get all that. I just want to do the outro. Yeah. Just the outro. So now I got to do this. Man, I can't believe I did that. That is so dumb. Here we go. And as I get dressed here, uh, we're going to go ahead and tell you that I'm very excited, very proud of what's happening uh, with Layer 1 right now. We still have a lot to do, I think. That's pretty obvious, but it's starting to evolve on its own, right? So I'm going to be looking for more and more opportunity to make sure that we are creating a very scary, very uncomfortable ex experience, right? So if you can think of anything, uh, the throw it in the comment section. I might check that out. It might inspire something entirely different. Who knows? We don't, uh, we don't really know where it's going to go. I just like the fact that we're moving forward in a very organic fashion, and we're not really thinking too much on it. We're just going to keep on going. Just keep just let it know how it feels. Let, make it more confusing. Make it so you can't wait to get out of there. You know, you want people just suffering the whole way up, right? We, we talked about that, so uh, we'll continue that in the next episode, right? But until then, you guys, you know the drill. Be good, be good to each other. I'll see you soon. There we go. That one we got. That one we got. Uh, okay. Pop. And that's good. That's good. And I'm going to... There we go. All right, so yeah, I was missing stuff in chat. I'm sorry. 
Dang it, why does that happen? You guys see that? That makes me crazy. And the crowd goes wild. Uh, okay, so that's what we're going to continue to work on next time. I am going to wrap up the stream here. I'm going to finish this episode, and I'm going to get the podcast done. we got a lot to do. A lot going on. So you guys are absolutely amazing. Thank you so much, guys, for sticking around and being a part of this. So, uh, And to you guys, I think you know the drill. But I can't say it yet because we haven't raided somebody. And this is one of my funnest things. One of my, one of my most favorite things to do is to raid. And uh, so let's check it out. We're going to raid. I got always got always to click on that. What is that? Um, oh, yeah. Oh, easy peasy. Starting soon. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. This is who we're raiding. I'm sending you guys over to the one, the only. Ladies and gentlemen, Evil Notion. We love them. Uh, so we're going to load that up. And then tomorrow, hopefully I can stream tomorrow. We're going to have to see where we stand on that. Um, I'm going to be just doing the same thing. Trying to get after my work as much as possible uh, so I can stream. But we're going to have to see. There's a lot, come, a lot I have to kind of deal with right now. Um, <laughs> Princey Skiz joins him at craft. So Skiz, what's your idea of the season? Skiz, to make everyone suffer <laughs> Pretty much Alright, you guys say hello to Evil Notion Trying to make him smile And until next time, you be good, be good to each other I will talk to you, thank you everybody